gentlemen, now it is time. It's a segment that everyone looks forward to. One of the highest rated segments of all time that I've ever done. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time. Phil's day off. What's up, Piggy? Let's get it started. Big up some ears, Dad. It's my day off. Might leave the game with on a jerk off. It's my day off. Spend money on pulls and damn shit. It's my day off. Might go out with my bitch wife, can't. Give me money today. Give me money today. This is where my fucking money goes to every month. Garbage dump, grocery shopping, pay my taxes, pet store, pay my bills, pay my bills. Blowing his money on mobile games, blowing his money on this and that. I'm spending all this money by your dash for my business. I need to put disgusting food in the mouths of my family members. Obviously, I need tips. Yes, I spend money on mobile games. Okay? These are my life priorities. Pay my taxes. It's my day off. Might leave the game with on a jerk off. It's my day off. Spend money on pulls and damn shit. It's my day off. Might go out with my bitch wife can't give me money today. Obviously, I need tips. Give me money today. This is where my fucking money goes to every month. Shout out to the trolls. For those who contributed, thank you. It would be great if we get a few more tips. Uh, to make up earlier today, we did not hit the, the, the hat goal either. Uh, it's been a very slow day. It would be great if we need to pick it up a little bit with uh, maybe some contributions inside with tips. If you can, just saying, you know, I know some people are super chatting or whatever, that helps long term, but right now I really can help. Tomorrow's my day off, the tips I'll have for my day off, you see? Give me money today. It's WWE Champion time. Go, 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 go. It's the money, stupid fuck. I love it. Go, go, go. It's been tough. I always think that it's my fault. Drinking gin. Yep, I'm toxic. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. My ass is so fucking stretched. Oh, no, you didn't, you motherfucking piece of shit cocksucker. Mark my fucking words. I'm coming for you. For now? Go, 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 go. It's the money, stupid fuck. I love it. Go, 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 go. What? I eat it. Hell! Hateful slurs. Lame brain pieces of dumb fucking hateful slurs. Why am I toxic? I love it. Hey, Mr. Bernal, you there? I am Chris. I am Chris. I am Chris. I understand. He's claiming that he's got five thousand dollars a month in expenses and only five thousand dollars a month in income, and that's about thirty-five dollars. Band, 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 gone forever. And you know what this reminds me of? When I worked at the helicopter company, helicopter support. It one million percent reminds me of that. American oh. Band, 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 gone forever. major company, a helicopter company, it's called Aftermarket Support for Helicopters, okay? They're flying around, uh-oh, uh-oh, things are breaking down, P -p parts are wearing out, we're a one-stop shop for helicopters, so I was told, we see potential for you, uh-oh, you're better than just working customer support, revamp the business from ground up, you can map it out and find bottlenecks and find shortcomings and find helicopters so that our company runs more efficiently, okay? So I busted my ass, I worked my ass off, I did double work, double, double work, never got paid for it. And you say, oh, it's part of the process, man, it's just part of corporate America. Fuck you. Band, 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 gone forever. Band, 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 gone forever. Band, 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 gone forever. Band, 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 band. It happened to me 
fuck you. Why don't you listen to me? You don't know shit. It happened to me. So shut the fuck up. Why don't you listen to me? Because no one cares. To me, fuck you. Why don't you listen to me? You don't know shit. It happened to me. So shut the fuck up. Why don't you listen to me? Cause no one cares. It happened to me. Fuck you. Why don't you listen to me? You don't know shit. To me, so shut the fuck up. Why don't you listen to me? Because no one cares. Why do I say I'm not a children's entertainer? Because I'm not a puppet. I'm not here to play a character. I'm not here to pretend that I'm something that I'm not. I don't dye my hair. I don't act stupidly constantly to get attention from children. I don't do stupid pranks. You know what I mean? I don't cause drama. I'm here just to play games and have fun. I'm a legitimate gamer. They go scared and I eat banana, tasty banana, put banana in my mouth, tasty banana. I eat banana, tasty banana. Please don't peel it, comes in the middle. Put banana in my mouth, squeeze banana. Put banana in my mouth, squeeze banana. Put banana in my mouth. Talk a certain way with certain mannerisms, certain over the top reactions, screaming at the top of their lungs, jumping, flailing, doing weird things constantly on camera. I need banana, tasty banana, put banana in my mouth, tasty banana. I need banana, tasty banana. Please don't peel it, comes in the middle. Put banana in my mouth, squeeze banana. Put banana in my mouth. bubble blow. Very nice. There's bubbles everywhere. There's bubbles all over my PlayStation 4 controller. There's bubbles on my microphone stand. There's bubbles everywhere tonight. I actually admitted this last year. I'll say it again. I actually do play some mobile games. I do. Burger right. King. The ones that I play are free to play or incredibly inexpensive. Like you spend a dollar here or there to make progress. This one's for all my baby girls. Got me that gotcha. gotcha. I love it. Gotcha. Got me that gotcha. Gotcha. gotcha! Begging for fucking tips and shit on street. It's WWE Champions. I'm, I'm stupid. WWE game plays like Candy Crush. That being said. 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 Hello, hello. This is Phil. Phil Burnett. All right. And um, just wanted to tell you that I love the podcast. That being said, big ups. That being said, which vest is podcast vest? That being said, relaxing, chill, interactive, fun. That being said, which vest is podcast vest? That being said, relaxing, chill, interactive, fun. A L Team Insight, the legend. Fantastic, Mr. Sam. The dentist. Sneak to the dead. Psychological style host. Me or cat. Artistic style host. That being said, which vest is 
this podcast. That's tap being said. Rich Vest is podcast best. If there was ever meaningful content, it's being produced right here on that being said. <laughs> <laughs> Huh. Oh. Anyways, that being said here Thursday, right on time. Best time of the week, right the fuck here. You know what I'm saying? Sam back in the booth. Look, so happy to see you back, brother. Last Sunday was rough. Not going to lie. Not going <laughs> to try to lie. And you not being there added to that. So thanks, asshole. Anyways, just kidding. We're back in action here. We got fucking Cerebral. We don't have the Cerebral style. We're wishing him the best. Hope we get some updates from a Cerebral style soon. But we got the legendary musical style in the house. Meerkat, how you feeling? Hey, what's up, everybody? Awesome. Very fun. Awesome, awesome. And, and let, we have the legendary secret musical style, Wizard of Oz style. How you feeling? Hello. <laughs> Real quick. I haven't done before, that for a while. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come on. And we did, we did get the news just dropped from legendary brand dude that says there is a video in the house. Just dropped. And we are going to live react to that video. And let's just start with that. Real quick, before we start with it, though, let's get some bold predictions around the room. All right, Meerkat, what is your bold prediction? What is something he will say? Anything is fine. What's one of your predictions for this video? Well, it's first of all, the video, yeah. uh, the, the video is about the internet issues that he's had. For those that don't know, well, that's the thing. He had internet issues. And I guess he thought it was important enough to give us all an update. And we're going to dive in and find out what that is. But I'm thinking that it's still going on if it got him concerned enough to post a whole ass 15 minute video. This video is 15 minutes long. Yes. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's probably hasn't fixed yet. Hasn't hasn't happened. I don't know. Yeah. All right. what, okay, let's do, a, let's do a poll. If you if you saw the video, you cannot answer in this poll. OK, I'm going to do a poll. Is the Internet fixed? If you watched it, you cannot vote. If you vote, you're banned. That's the poll. Go ahead, Mr. Sam. Your point. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say three mentions. Oh, maybe that's not enough. Three fuck it. Three mentions of my business. I it's probably gonna be a lot more than that. But that's <laughs> what I'm looking for. So Sam's got the bold three mentions of business. Okay. Yeah. A good here. call. And let me get start poll going. Get out of here, options. Fuck out of here. Added options. I'll put you to add options that I could do it. All right, start the fucking poll. Here we go. Yes or no? I'm my go ahead, go ahead, Sam, please. I was just going to say, I'm thinking we put it on like 1.5 uh, speed as well, because it's it's 15 fucking minutes, man, of presumably something that could be summed up in like a couple of sentences. So that's what I'm Here's, thinking. My bold prediction is the internet is fixed, but he still has to upgrade something. All right. So he can stream, but he has to upgrade something. So he has to let us know that he still needs the money for something, but he it's fixed. So it's fixed, but... So fixed, but caveat. That's what I'm guessing. All right. Okay. Mm. okay. Yeah. 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 Sounds good. Right. Okay. <laughs> Let's hear it. Sorry about this. This is going to be like out of sync as well. I still haven't found a way to fix it. So like audio and visual are going to be messed up, but here we go. At least we can all watch it together. Yes. Hey everyone. What's up? Phil here with an update, an unexpected update. As you can see, mm. I'm about to head out the door and have Seems a day, out wearing street on my day off from streaming and content. But I felt that it was appropriate for me to film a special video to keep you all in the know about what's going on with my current internet issues mm -hmm. um, and how this is going to affect my content moving forward. Uh, I have many updates, none of which are great, but at least I have updates ah. that you know. I would ask if you're a fan or a hater and you just want to know what the hell's going on, spread the yeah, word about the video so people know what's happening. Um, okay. So in a nutshell, yesterday during my live stream- <laughs> Wait, pause it. Home, so he said spread. Like, spread it even if you're a hater. So just yeah, spread it out, guys. Hater. Even if you're Send a hater. to all your friends. <laughs> So, so you can know when you can come back and make fun of Phil again, you know? <laughs> <laughs> spread it, guys. Just spread it out. All right. <laughs> oh, shit, yeah. Who was it that just said that? Uh, solid sloth. Wrong date. It's not the 27th. Oh. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Fucking hell, Phil. <laughs> Look at this face right now, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's been tough. I want to hear, hear him say what he just said. Hang on. Yeah, yeah. No, I would ask if you're a fan. Or a hater, and you just want to know what the hell's going on, spread the word about this video so people know what's happening. Uh, so in a nutshell, Why? yesterday during my live stream, both modems in my home, because I own two internet lines, oh. disconnected from the internet, or at least oh. lost internet connectivity for about a minute, 
when it came back, I've had nothing but problems. Now, the weirdest part about it is that my desktop computer remains connected to the internet and still is able to stream and upload. However, there's been some updates with that, and I'll tell you about those in a second. Um, oh, God. It still seems like that desktop computer remains online and is able to do functionality stuff for my work. <laughs> Everything else in my house isn't working. This laptop wait, wait. cannot connect either to wait, wait. that modem or... Functional functionality stuff. So, I'm not sure what that means, but it can do functionality stuff. So, it does work, I think. Does okay. that count as working? If it does functionality stuff? <laughs> Fuck knows, man. <laughs> uh, who knows what old man Phil means by that? I don't know. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Phone downstairs. All my game consoles are not able to connect to either modem. Uh, my phone. I don't even have, I don't know where it is. Uh, oh, there it is. Uh, also, won't connect. It basically what happens is all my devices connect to these modems. Mm -hmm. And then it should go on the internet and it says internet not available. Uh, if you look in a browser window, it'll say something like uh, connection denied or, uh, you know, cannot connect to server, contact your ISP. So after this, you know, ruined my stream yesterday. You know, I was doing a Spider-Man stream. We couldn't finish it. <clears throat> Last <laughs> night, we did a two and a half hour troubleshooting stream. Okay. Where, thankfully, you know, my viewers and fans tried to help me. And I really appreciate that, that you guys oh, come out with me for two and a half hours and we tried God. to figure this out. Um, basically, what we discovered is it's got to be something on the server side from my ISP. My ISP is Comcast. Mm -hmm. Um, because here's why. If I change my DNS server from the Comcast default auto-detected server to, mm -hmm. say, Google server, which I believe is like 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 or something like that, I can get online, but it's incredibly okay. slow. It doesn't really fully load anything. It, like, I can get to Google search. I can half load a YouTube page, but it won't load fully. Um, it's a mess, but I can still load it, which means, obviously, this has something to do with their servers, and something happened whenever these modems went, lost internet for a minute or whatever yesterday, and came back, something changed in them to screw all this up. I don't know. <laughs> So we tried Hold to on, can you pause real quick? Yeah, so it's I, I would like to mention them. how appreciative he was that he wasted two hour, two and a half hours of people's time for them in the end to tell him that the problem is actually in the ISP. Something that you could have figured out pretty much immediately. And so, yes, by the fantastic. way, was announced publicly, wasn't it? I know he said it wasn't, but like there was a whole fuck of maps that people had on Twitter that show that internet problems were on. You know, there was yeah. problems in multiple places around the country. He's like, well, there's nothing official. It's like, well, what? <laughs> I like how something has changed inside. Something has changed within me <laughs> in the fucking modems. <clears throat> Again, this is a great freeze frame, by the way. If anyone wants to. Oh, this is the grab farm. That one. <laughs> freeze frame farm. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we left it at number one today, Thursday, the 26th of October. I have to call Comcast and work with them to figure out what's going on. And I got to figure out a way to get all my stuff ready for Friday. Because if you don't know, on Friday, it's a big day for me. I'm supposed to be playing Alan Wake 2, the hot new release. 13 <laughs> oh. years we've been waiting for this game. Um, how am I going to play it if I have no internet? Right? So a few what? days ago, <laughs> last night, something clicked in my head and I remembered something. I was like, you know, I upgraded my internet package uh, earlier this year. And when I uh -huh. did that. They gave me a device that I never thought I would have any use for, all right? They actually gave me a backup cellular mobile data internet device for a business. Because, you know, I'm on Comcast oh, discount. Oh, they assume I'm running business? a business? Yep. They seriously assume I'm running like a retail nice store pull. at the point of sale stuff. Uh, yeah. And so my internet <laughs> down. Come. This is a device that's a redundant backup. So you at least have basic <laughs> internet in the case that your whole, you know, cable modem internet lines go down. So this device is a like a 4G wireless device, and it oh. is insanely slow. It is slower <laughs> than my cell phone. It's slower than thing I, anything I've used in the last decade. It's that slow. But it works. It connects to the internet. So last night, I just hooked this thing up on a whim. I'm like, you know, I wonder, could I get this thing working with my uh -huh. Xbox and buy and download Alan Wake 2? Yes, I can. And I Do did. you play mobile games? I have Alan Wake 2 on my <laughs> right now, ready to go. But yes. it took over 12 hours to download it. It was like a snail's case. And this internet connection is wild. It'll I mean, be like... 20 megabytes just quickly yeah, that's positive. why you that's why you do these things offline you know you don't wait <laughs> until you uh you're about to stream to do them so that's you and know I'll, at least that's that's something that's something he's done that didn't he call them like assholes for giving him that piece of equipment though by the way i think i remember like they were assholes they gave me this fucking equipment never gonna use it fucking yeah. assholes i didn't I'm ask gonna, for this <laughs> i'm gonna also assume that people were telling him to use it during the stream as the troubleshooting stream, oh yeah and uh <laughs> I'm guessing he probably didn't immediately oh, agree. No. no, his 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 like uh, the whole stream. His uh, solutions were were it consisted of unplugging it and plugging it back in. That of course that's basically it, really, isn't it? I mean, that's what I saw. But <laughs> I mean, if that's usually that that's you know that's the first thing you go to. Yeah, yeah, but, definitely. But like, but, I'm not streaming that. I'm not streaming it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And also, you you continue to do things after that as well. You don't just try that again and again. You know. Uh, from anyway, that, from that troubleshooting segment, I have one very nice out of context clip 
Uh, Sam, oh, if you could play it. It's oh. the OOC internet one. Yeah, yeah, I've got it. Here we go. No, now it says no internet but secured connection to my router downstairs. How the fuck can I have no internet? What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> what, what, what does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> okay, now. Right. That's, Here we yeah. go. Less than a megabyte per second. 30 megabytes per second. Disconnected. Reconnected. It's a nightmare. It's a nightmare. Okay, I, I, I have a question for you guys. I have a question for you. Please. So in these almost five minutes, we've pretty much got the entire story covered. So yes, th yeah. this, this is still a problem with the internet. What the fuck is he going to talk about for the next 10 minutes? Is it going to be scheduling? Hopefully his business. But... <laughs> he, he might talk uh... about how he's going to move around the different games, how he's going to shift his schedule. That's going to be very exciting. Mm, could be. Uh, see, I don't think Shinko and Improper. I see you both saying begging. Amron saying begging. It's tough to piv I know he could, he's the best pivoter in the business, right? He could talk, be talking about fucking birds and the bees, and he'll switch it to begging right away. He's the best pivoter there is. But uh, this is tough to pivot to, right? No, think... no, no, no. This is not tough to pivot from. This is this is no, prime no, with, pivot territory. <laughs> oh yeah. With, with how much time is left? He got ten minutes left. You can't start it now. You got to end so with that. Phil can talk about anything for 10 minutes. He, he can keep just saying the same thing over and over again for 10 <laughs> minutes. That is, that's fine. Hey, real, real quick. This is what he should be wearing on stream, by the way. I know he thinks it's like, this is different, but like, this is like much better than his fucking button downs and stuff. This is a normal shirt, but he like somehow yeah. thinks this is different than his streaming. Like this is not streaming wear. Like just it's, wear normal clothes. <laughs> it's street clothes. Yeah, well, he is now, like isn't he? We might see, we'll probably see this again because apparently he's the Nico Bellic style. Sorry, that derailed me. <laughs> oh God. Uh, <laughs> um, big ups, brand dude. Um, yeah. I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, well, yeah. he said the other day, like he made a big deal about how, like, these are just my the clothes that I'd normally wear, and I've decided that I'm going to start wearing these now. So this might be one in one that's in his regular rotation. Now. Okay, we might okay. see this again. Hopefully, yeah, he he probably wearing uh, jeans as well. <laughs> that's the day off clothes. Yeah, yeah, uh, right. yeah. No, no socks though. It'll just you know. Oh, you can't, you can't do that. Come on. Anyway, here we go. This crystal, this crystal's got to breathe. It's, it's wild, okay? <laughs> so it's essentially just a backup for very basic use. I left this on overnight. And overnight, it just, I'm not even kidding you, it just finished downloading about 30 oh. minutes ago. And right now it's 11.54 a.m. for me. So it just finished. So it took over 12 hours to download the game. So that's good to go. I have Alan Wake 2 for tomorrow. All right? Oh. Now. I don't think he's showered, by the way, has he? I think, is that greasy hair or is that poofy hair? Like, what are we saying? Poof or the grease? Two options. Mm. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, do you know what? I think, that is, I think that's it showered last night and, ah. and that's morning poof <laughs> that's what i think <laughs> Big anyway. up. that's the next poll <laughs> also by the way uh oh, super morning. busy day off it's almost noon and they're just about to go out yeah <laughs> I i'm just saying i mean it, the stories don't match up super busy yeah, it's right. I mean that yeah exactly i mean that's that's he he's been up for a couple of hours at this point hasn't he at most on his day off <laughs> He, he's, he's a 10 a.m. regular waker, isn't he? Oh, yeah. Oh, God, yeah. He's tweeting till 3 a.m. You know that. Yeah. Got to check out the old John tweets. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he's, just, he's rolled out of bed. He may have even slept in this T-shirt and he's just <laughs> whacked this on. <laughs> Alan Wake's done. Right. Record a video. Quick, quick, quick. <laughs> Kat, you go and put the, the coffee on or whatever. Right. Yeah. Here we go. <clears throat> I got up and I called Comcast. Here's the results of this conversation, okay? Test everything, nothing works. No kidding. Knew that was going to happen. I tried explaining to the person on the line the technical aspects of okay. what was going on. They, right. You can tell when someone has absolutely <laughs> no working this person is not a technical oh, person. No. The line. No, oh, no, 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 no. We're going to get it. Are they, do they speak English, Phil? <laughs> he what tried language? to explain to the tech support person the technical details, and they didn't want to hear any of it. He tried to go full on, like low level technical, explaining all the Wi Fi waves and the Ethernet cables and what goes where. They didn't want to listen. They ghosted him yet again. Yeah. He's the worst person to be like. Nightmare. Could you imagine, like, if he was. Okay, you're tech support, you're at the IT department at work, and he just works at, you know, he's just whatever, just admin or something. He would be the worst dickhead to go and sort out. Like, if he had an internet problem or something. He'd be such a twat. Dude, he's anyway. the dude, like this, this is the level. Okay, DSP tries are watching the WPIG. He's the guy that goes to Subway. You guys have Subway over there? I'm not sure. Do you have Subway in, in the UK? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. 
So, like, you know when they put them, you can see him get your sandwich ready and stuff, mm-hmm. right? He's the kind of douchebag that when they put meat on there, he's like, okay, that's not enough. They didn't oh, put yeah. enough meat on my sandwich. Can you put mm-hmm. more on there, please? Like, not asking for extra. He's saying, uh, I need more of that, you know? And, mm-hmm. you know, that, that's like shows what kind of person he is. You know what I'm saying? You know, he's like, yeah, I like everyone saying that. You know he says that 10 times. Allow me to explain. My pipelines are, it says no internet. Now, what exactly does that mean? And they tell him what to test, and you know what he does? I already checked that. I'm not checking it again. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, could you please check that, you know, could you check your, you know, if you're online in, in this thing? I already checked it. I'm not. <laughs> you know, you know he does that. It, it, it's, you got to, sh- that's when you get that call, you're like, how can I end this call as soon as possible? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> can, I, can we put this in an email, like, just to get rid of him? <laughs> yeah. And it, well, he would, wouldn't he? Anyway, let's carry on. Line level customer service support. Why they have no technical knowledge on people doing line level customer service support for a business, I have no idea, but that's what right. podcast chooses uh-huh. to do. Um, mm. So after over about half an hour on the phone of wasted time, essentially, uh, the person said they're going to have a tech come out tomorrow. At first, they said they wanted a tech to come out today. I said, I can't. Today's my day off. I'm literally within. Oh, oh my God. God. You <laughs> cannot be serious. <laughs> you cannot be serious. <laughs> Fuck off. You cannot be serious. Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> <laughs> That's almost a. Uh, what's the, is that the Usain Bolt? <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> got there. <laughs> <laughs> Play it again, Sam. Play it again. Oh, we've got to hear that again. I might slow it down as well. <laughs> All right, here we go. This is like mid snort, isn't it? Oh this God! Part. Here we go. Look. At first, they said they wanted to tech come out today. I, said, I can't. Today's my day off. I'm literally within tw- 20 minutes of me making this video. I'm out. I'm out the door. Sir, uh, it is 11 a.m., sir. I already set up that I have to do. It's my <laughs> one day off a week. I schedule everything for my one day off. So I literally can't be here today. Even oh, I'd want, love to I know exactly what it is. Like, what's he got planned today? Like, pet store and grocery shopping and then like... And that's it. By himself, yeah. too. <laughs> probably by himself <laughs> sir it's almost noon um <laughs> could we maybe do stuff later or before this <laughs> i'm literally out the door imagine that t- the, the the tech support dude it's like hearing that i'm literally out the door okay <laughs> so i guess we'll do it tomorrow if it th- must not be that big a problem then huh sir right it must not be that big of a problem all right we'll do it tomorrow then <laughs> just i mean just it goes without saying but you you you're a youtuber and this is what you're putting out yeah important internet issues update like what this is this kind of sounds like one of those channels with like 20 subs that think like they're they're about to blow up so they they give like a 20 sub special 25 <laughs> sub special 30 sub special yeah it's kind of something like uh redemption gaming would post those who know, <laughs> know what i mean yeah, yeah he yeah. posts stuff like this he has two viewers says all right guys sorry guys gotta move back to stream 15 minutes all right thanks yes. <laughs> thanks for letting us know <laughs> So Jesus. this is just elongating. Uh, this is uh, elongating the the problem. By the way, for Phil, of course, he wants to do that because he wants to keep talking about it. But you know, he wants to keep yeah. it going, keep the storylines going. The storylines have been light, as we know, and that's why well, he's got to yeah. get another one. <laughs> I mean, at least this is something, and it this is good. For, again, this is one of them where it's like this is great for us to sit and laugh about. But like, who's like unironically going? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, Phil. <laughs> It's Jade, Jade, Slayer, and Darren. Yeah. Oh, uh, end of you, list. Can you check if we got the the AI timestamps already? Is the guy <laughs> that fast? So we can yeah. actually see what we're we're gonna have in store, or somebody showing support. But there is there is have. one comment. What uh, is it from Radical Jaws? Funny moments, and it says, "Hope you figure out what happens soon. Good luck, Phil." So there you go. <laughs> mm-hmm. Perfect. I, I mean, maybe he has. He just hasn't had time to approve all the other millions. Yeah. Uh, right. Oh, yeah, right. Here we go. So they're going to come tomorrow, supposedly tomorrow afternoon. All right. So here's the deal. Here's what's going to happen. All right. Tomorrow, I'm going <laughs> to turn edge. on my stream at the normal time to do the podcast. We're going to chat. We're going to talk. We're going to have sure be game news and things to talk about and hang out. There's literally no reason for me to start the game because we're going to be interrupted at some point by a tech showing up to try to figure out what's going on with this internet. Okay. If I start the game, what's the point? You're going to get blue balls. I just start and I'll have to turn it off again. Right. <laughs> You're so, gonna get blue, blue balls. Blue balls. Blue Could balls. this be? 
could this be another uh, experiment? Are we gonna? Are we gonna? Like, is someone gonna Ooh. fuck with his internet provider, and he's gonna go? Ah, I see. This is all my dastardly plan. I don't know. Penton is saying, "Good point. You take twenty minute breaks before you game, anyway. You know, it's all it's all nonsense. He takes breaks like more breaks than anyone on the fucking internet. But mm, yeah, can't play a game because so, you'll get blue balls. It's like what is it? He balls. doesn't want to play. What is it? Is it what's the because Mario's not doing so well? But is is it's it's Alan Wake, isn't it? That that he's worried about. I don't know. Mm, I'm just yeah. thinking like, is this a ploy to like get out of playing something? But I don't fucking know. Yeah, who knows? <clears throat> We're it's gonna be start up, <laughs> talk, hang out, podcast, have a good time, and then whenever the tech shows up, go offline. See if the tech who's here can figure out what the heck is going on. I'm sure we're going to be doing crazy amounts of troubleshooting and everything on both modems to figure this out. <laughs> we're, really? then, we're... Then hopefully the tech will resolve it and we'll be back to normal. All right? Now. They're going to be back in like 20 minutes. I plug this laptop oh, yeah. into that 4G backup wireless device if I can get basic internet on it. And if I can, that means I should be able to stream the game and have the laptop with the chat and all your contributions working. It should be a normal stream. All right? It's Bro. like as heck. But it can we do this now? <laughs> his real problem is that he can't look at chat on his fucking laptop. I was just about preventing him from streaming. He just can't look at fucking chat and PayPal notifications. That's his whole thing. I was just going to say the same thing because it's the laptop is the only issue here. Yeah, and it, that's it. He used to not have that laptop, didn't he? Um, mm -hmm. I don't know what he did. Yeah, it was a gift that. from somebody or something. Yeah, one of those gifts. You know. Did he have another laptop or did he do something else? Did he have his chat up on the monitor? I can't remember. Um, Someone will tell me. But anyway. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. <clears throat> Thanks for pointing that out. He can stream. Yeah. Everyone yeah. is saying uh, he can definitely stream. The only problem is seeing the chat and the contributions. And which he, he has other options available. Let's not get it twisted. You can do that on other means. You have a, you have a cell phone that you do a lot of stuff with that you could do that with. You know, not see chat. I was chat just going to say, yeah. All the way. But you can phone. see contributions, you know. Yeah. If that's so important to you, you know. If 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 he did things like we are, he you know he could have his chat up on the OBS and read it from mm. there, stuff like that. Yeah, I, idiot. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is some. There's something going on here. This, this yeah, this is kind of fishy. It. It's kind of fishy, right? It is kind of weird. It, it's mm. is it all of this because he, it can't just be because he can't read chat. That can't be it. I I think so. I think it might might think there is some more complexity to this but i think it's just like simply he's in his own way again and he's being stupid in the way that only he can be stupid at that's why it's so fascinating and big up snood yeah snood Damn, bro, dropping the bomb thanks snood you're a legend yeah big up. a lot of contributions i'll read them all out after we get past this you know breaking news segment all right guys <laughs> this important <laughs> update yeah well yeah. something is breaking yeah. apparently so <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah right here we go. Let's go. It's wrong. Halfway. Solve the problem. You might say, "Oh, if that works, then just leave it like that." What are you crazy? I have a whole internet modem downstairs. It doesn't work. I can't have any. I have no internet on my phone. I'm using the cellular data on my phone to get it to work. You know, like I'm paying for internet. It's not working right now. So I have to have the person come and fix this. Plus, sadly, here is a negative update. Okay, as I told you, my desktop computer is still working on this, but not the laptop, not the phones, not the console. Okay. Just the desktop. Right. Working, but okay. not fully. This is so weird. Listen to this. Okay. Anything here we I go. Do in my Chrome browser works, including loading my YouTube pages and all of that. It works. Okay. Anywhere else I go, I go to you know x cnn.com any random website all works through the chrome browser all right <laughs> CNN. I also have firefox <laughs> firefox partially works and what i mean by that is it'll load certain sites but not others i can't actually get chrome excuse me i can't actually get firefox to load youtube right now <clears throat> i don't know why right, usually right. what i pause, have like, right and one i'll have open dsp game so meerkat is our technical style host oh, i mean no, i'm okay technical style host. is that even i don't understand how that works how is this, i don't know how, either i don't know yeah uh, i'm sure somebody in the comments of yeah, come on, this comments, right here video or the chat is gonna know this seems uh, like completely I, impossible to me, but maybe I don't know enough, you know? Yeah, we, yeah I, I've, I've seen, seen profit in the point. chat, so I'm sure yeah, we'll get that, some. Yeah, exactly. Mm. I've oh, seen really people break profit. this down, so I don't know how it works. I don't care. I just want to see what's left of this video, because I'm still completely <laughs> mystified. But what what can we talk about for the almost 10 minutes left? Yeah, mm. yeah, this should have been wrapped up, uh, like... This should have been two minutes, if it even needed to be a fucking video on your YouTube This should have been a right? short. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. This Just a short. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Big update. Yeah. yeah, big update. Network's still not fixed. We're going to fix it tomorrow. Show up for the podcast. Peace out. That's it. Yeah. At least then he'll have something to talk about on his podcast. And then he could just get back to his day off. and not Because he presumably as well, he had to 
babysit this up- upload as well, didn't he? You know, so yes. he's recorded a video and he's had to upload it. <sighs> you see why cat doesn't go anywhere? Cat, mm. get out of there. What's this shit, man? They're day off. You're gonna go out together. Hang on, honey. You gotta update a video. You done up? You done recording it? Yeah, I'm done. Now it's gotta babysit the upload, honey. Hold on, I gotta I gotta check the comments. We'll leave it about an hour. You know, it's like what the fuck? <laughs> God damn it. Uh, okay, so that answers it, I think, from ot- utterly insane. Um it's hang on, sorry. It's a cached DNS issue. The desktop has entries in the DNS cache, so doesn't need lookups for some sites. The other devices have lost their cache. So okay. I'm guessing like this uh, yeah, that, that that's kind of what I gathered from it. Um oh, that man. was what much better put than I could have. Um, they lost their cache kind of like DSP <laughs> when he declared bankruptcy. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> There you go. Is oh, it speaking cache of uh, cache, I don't know. Yeah, anyway. it's it, it, it's. I think it's pronounced cache, but the the word is French, cache. I guess. But didn't he uh, do that? Yeah. Didn't he do that? By the way, yesterday though, he did flush the cat the DNS yesterday. I remember that. Yes, but he did. Maybe he needs to do it again. I mean, who knows? But I don't know. Oh. Uh, what I know is he's been spending on champions again. We back and on the day off too. Oh yeah. Very nice. Excellent. That's the TJ Gamebox update. Big ups. Oh, okay. Right, Profit has another thing, another idea. Uh, it's not a cache DNS issue. It's a NAT problem, or NAT, whatever that is. All right. But anyway, I'm sure Phil's going to go into de- detail here about it. This oh. Again, this is another great uh, pause. You <laughs> can't miss. Hmm. Right. All right, go ahead. Here we go. And the other one I'll have open logged into my other channel, DSP React. I cannot get the DSP React thing to load. No matter what I try, it won't load it. It says no internet connection. How is that possible that I'm on the same browser, Right. I can go to one site, but then when I try to go to YouTube, it says no internet connection. That makes no sense whatsoever, does it? It seems like there's a really messed up thing going on. I feel like what happened is they pushed some kind of an update to both modems yesterday. For most people, it doesn't affect them, but for me, for my use, it does. And it's just destroyed my business. Like, I don't even know what else to say. Um, hey, business. But it's not anything I changed. I've changed nothing. It's, you know, it's on their end. They screwed this up. And now me and a tech tomorrow are going to have to sit here and put our heads together. Trying to no, you don't. What the hell is going on. Please. And who knows if we're going to put our heads what together. What was that? Oh, fuck Put off. our heads together. Who's putting heads together? Tech comes in, does everything, and then leaves. There's no heads together. Putting heads yeah. together. He can't he can't just accept help on this one. It has to be like, yeah, I helped. I was there. Mm-hmm. Putting heads together. I'll put a head together. What's the <laughs> what's the chance that the tech is gonna tell him that he was completely right in diagnosing the problem? One thousand percent. Oh the tech yeah. said actually I helped him out a lot. <laughs> And also, additionally, what's the chance that the tech is going to talk shit about the company he works at and tell him that they're intentionally having a, a bad service? Oh, again, a thousand percent true. Yeah, he's going to say Comcast is trying to take over the world and steal everyone's money on Earth. And the, yeah. and the, the guy's going to agree with that. <laughs> Phil's going to yeah. agree with him when he says that. Oh, yeah, I, I thought that. <laughs> right. Here we go. I had three business mentions, so now I'd like no more, please, Phil. Right, yes, here we no go. more. Figure it out. Isn't this great? You know, pay for two high-end business lines of internet, and this, is, <laughs> this just happens out of nowhere. Um, two business lines? You might say, well, can't you get any more help? No, this is the help I'm getting from Comcast. Is all they can do is have a tech come, come out. On, pivot. They don't have anyone else okay. who apparently, you know, can help with this kind of high-level stuff. Pivot. They said the best thing to do is have a tech come out. Pivot. So that's what I'm doing. And tomorrow, like I said, hopefully I'll be able to start up my stream normally and have a normal stream um until the tech comes hopefully the tech and i can figure this out solve the problem and both modems will be working fine and we'll be back to normal after that and of course whenever it gets solved i would love to get back up and running and play alan wake with you guys um but i don't see any point in starting the game when i know the tech is coming early afternoon it's supposed to at the earliest they said they'll show up as like noon but i have never once seen the tech show up the earliest you know what i mean like, it's probably gonna be like sometime <laughs> in the later afternoon i almost guarantee it um, tech and i so i guess we'll see what happens right that's all we can do is wait and see what happens tomorrow hopefully everything keeps working on the desktop and i can at least get the basic stream going i can start the podcast we can hang out together for a while um now Obviously, this is throwing my entire business into disarray. Oh, I, was out on yeah. <laughs> I didn't get to play Mario last night. I don't even know what's going to happen. Disarray. I'm back and I boot this thing up. I don't know if I'm going to be able to fix it. I have no idea. All right. So what can you do to help? Well, obviously, there's a ton of content already you can watch, right? Like, <laughs> watch the stuff I've already uploaded. That's number 15 one. years. Two, if you would like to support in some way, please, by all means, do. I, I really hey. 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 Yes. Now massively negatively affect me, you know, which I can't, which is going to be like, let me put it this way. All right. I'm very yeah, happy that I'm not in a position anymore that I'm living day to day because I was very much like years ago. Okay. What? Right. Like every day, I was like, I gotta raise this much today, or I can't pay my bills, or I can't do this. It was. Luckily, I'm not necessarily. Pause, in pause, that pause. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It was bad. like last week. His YouTube payment was late, and he was like, at he was threatened by not being able to pay his bills. 
Yes. Last so week, did, uh, because recap. of like two days. Yeah, recap. Yeah, he said he's not day to day, but he absolutely was last week. Two days. Two two days without being paid is it's 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 you know level red problem. The the business is okay, guys. Let's get this straight too. The business is being thrown in disarray, but I'm not living day to day, so it's not a big deal. Is that what we're gonna hear here? The business is both in disarray yet no problem, guys. Okay. I love my life. I love my life. I love my wife. Italian life. Mm -hmm. Well, Sam, okay. please. The uh, right. great. Uh, the other clip. Yeah. yeah uh, the curator go. clip. I think yeah. that. Here's that the fits deal. Perfectly. I have a life. I love my life. I love being a streamer and a content creator and a content curator and a gamer that gets to share that with you guys all day, every day, six days a week. I listen to that I earlier. Love, <laughs> I, I listen to that I earlier. I love that he added the content curator to the fucking <laughs> list of buzzwords. He is the content curator now. It's all good. What's going to be next? <laughs> I listened hey, to that what, earlier. What I was there? just like... He sounds like he's quoting meerkat lyrics at this point. Like yeah. you know. <laughs> content creator, fifteen year yeah. curator, <laughs> Italian streamer, a reactor. <laughs> Wait till he has a reactor, meaningful reactor. That's the next line. Oh, what else yeah. could it be? <laughs> right. Oh, by the way, just real quick, this is this is so nothing. But the the scopely event that's happening right now is the saloon sickness. So that means wow. that everyone is green because they're turning into zombies. So this is really hot, <laughs> hey guys. If you want to start playing, like I get it, because I might, because I want to get that fucking Undertaker, green Undertaker. That's hype. Yeah. I mean, that's yeah, legit. You've you got a spare couple of grand just burning a hole in your pocket. <laughs> Why not? Oh my god, we got zombie Steve, <laughs> zombie Undertaker. It's hype, dude. Zombie Hogan, dude. Yeah. Dude. They got a zombie Shawn Michaels as well. Uh -huh. Hi, wow, dude. holy shit. I want this, man. All right, sorry. I'm going to get in champions real quick. after This This screen. means you have to make zombie versions of all of your uh, WPRG cards. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Make them, like, slightly rarer. Zombie what? Hogan's. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, here we go. The problem is, I don't want to go back to where I was. Do you understand what I mean? Uh -huh. I've been doing good. I've been trying to pull myself out of a kind of a situation where that's the case. And if now I'm going to have- He's talking day, about it like he was in prison. I can't do my regular work. Uh -huh. I can't make the money I usually make. It will put me into a bad position again. And I, I'm, I'm definitely afraid that this thing, the way it's going and how weird it is, that it's going to be something that Comcast has never faced before. They don't know what the hell's going on. And it's going to be some <laughs> yeah. horrible thing. And it's going to be nice, you know? As is, I'm paying for it and I don't have it. You know, I have a modem down there. So I can't get anything out of it. You know, it's worthless and I'm paying for it. Um, I'm really hoping that they're going to be able to figure this out tomorrow. You know, but I don't know. I'm, I'm skeptical. When we sat here for two and a half hours, Last night, and we tried everything. You sat the there. The best we could do is connect via a, a different DNS server, like the Google server, and we could get Google to load and YouTube to half load, but it was slow and it wasn't really working. What you and Jade sat there. Who probably <laughs> never faces this kind of an issue. is just going to know how to fix this, right? Like, I don't have faith in it. I don't. I get the feeling uh -huh. this is going to be an issue. They're going to come. We're going to be here for two hours. Nothing's going to get resolved. They're going to have to escalate, escalate, internally search, escalate, and it's going to be, you know, I hope it's not weeks. Because <laughs> number one, weeks. I'm on my life. This, if this PC restarts or turns off or if this internet resets, I might just lose connection and that's it. Now I can't stream at all, right? I'm lucky that I still have that connection working for some odd reason. I don't even know how, but it is still working. But like I said, it's weird because it's like half capacity. It won't load certain sites like YouTube. It won't load YouTube in my Firefox browser. Why? Obviously something is up. Something's going on. Um, <laughs> you know, we're in a situation where at any moment's notice, things can fall apart. And this is my business. And it's not right. It's not right to be in this position. Who knows what's going on? No one seems to know. That's the thing. You know, like we try to figure it out. Did Comcast screw this up? I don't know. Jade. So, it's Jay didn't know what please, happened. If you can support content right now that I'm doing, there's so uh -oh. many people who support my content, watching it, engaging with it, doing a super thanks on an on-demand video. If you look at the description <laughs> oh. of any of my videos in the last several months, there's always a link for a tip. You can send me a tip if you want to help that way. Um, oh, okay. Tomorrow, Thank let's God. hope for the best to see what happens on the live stream, you know, and we'll go from there. But yeah, I'm already set back. And now there's potential that this week, this is a big release week with Alan Wake 2 and continuing with Spider-Man, continuing with Mario, that now I'm not going to be able to do what I need to do, you know? What I'm going to do, like I said, right now, I'm going to plug in this laptop over here to this 4D wireless device and see if I can get it kind of working. So at least I can have like a normal stream tomorrow, but that's not a solution. It's we figure out what is the root cause of the problem because it could the whole thing could come down, right? All right, guys. So before I ramble on too long, thank you for watching. Uh, too I'm late. Now. Before like I said, I'm, listen, I'm out the door uh, <laughs> to spend the day with my wife and do a bunch of appointments and other things. And uh, let's hope for the best. Fingers crossed. And uh, let's see if tomorrow we can get this resolved. But hopefully, I'll still be able to, to get Alan Wake tomorrow. You know, we'll see. I have it installed. I'm ready to play. But we gotta see if we can get it working. All right. So thank you all. I appreciate everything. Have a good day. Rest of today, and I'll hopefully see you tomorrow. Peace out. All right. So shout wow. out. I agree with T, by the way. Shout outs to T. I'm counting this as a big video. I am too. I think that's a hundred percent big video. Oh, yeah. You don't get the big tweets anymore. The 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 big the because remember the last three streams have been less than fifty. So he, this is definitely a big video. That's why he's doing it now. No yeah. doubt about it. That's all it was. Like 
like there's no other point like why do we need to know this information other than my business my business my business my business my business as you know, that was five <laughs> wasn't it i think um, yeah all right now, now i need to recap it's our not even gonna moments. delay him <laughs> tomorrow when he shows up for a stream nothing is, is going to be different he's going to start at the same time do his podcast so there's nothing really emergency in this it's just like 15 minutes of explaining why he's a victim and how it's bad and the weird part was him talking about how when he was financially destitute it sucked and now he's getting closer to being back there so that's pretty weird but uh couldn't happen to a nicer guy that's what i was saying <laughs> outside of all the begging really good nice guy all right favorite moment for me was saying that uh when the, the it's acting like the 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 commer the person trying to schedule an appointment on the same day so you pay for business internet sir we can get you an appointment right now today all right how does yeah. that sound and phil made it sound like they were idiots for that uh impossible up, 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 20 minutes about the door uh it's my day off and that is at 11.49 a.m. on his one day off. And again, um, second best part, this does not affect his life at all. This does not affect his stream at all. He just cannot see chat and contributions, and he can't ban as fast as he might want. That's it. Yeah, yeah I mean, couldn't Cat stay at home to, you know, have the technicians come over, and they're going <laughs> to do their job. They're going to run diagnostics on everything they'll figure out what's wrong you don't really need this guy there if he has something to do and somebody can stay at home well i i don't fucking know it's dsp dude the, the dude is barely ever acts in any kind of rational way yeah i mean yeah for, for anyone else that would be the solution okay you stay at home and i'll i'll go out and buy pet food or whatever but uh yeah for phil he needs to be there oh but yeah again, phil thinks he's helping guys Save yeah him. <laughs> Then again, yeah, she could do, do the opposite. You know, she should be going out and leaving him to at home then, unless team health, cat. I don't know. Anyway, um, whatever. It's, it's ridiculous. It's this is a this is a very weak, at least it's something for us. So it's kind of like a new mini saga. It's something, but this is a very weak. It only works if your mind does not work. If your mind is not functional, you will believe what he just said to you, right? If your mind functions at all, you cannot believe what he said to you. It just it's straight up right to your face. There's not even a problem. And he's saying, guys, whew, I, I used to it used to suck not having money. You know what I'm saying? Man, it's looking that way. It's looking like we might go back there. So how many times has he said that though? Like the, you know, <laughs> I was I was everything was just about okay. And then Twitch kicked me out of the partnership program and all hell broke loose. And this is just the latest and the long line of that. You know, it's it, how I think he said. He said something. Oh, I'm, I, you go, Mirkal. He said something similar <laughs> like yesterday as well about something else. I I think in his 15 year history, you can go back to any year and look up one year prior, and he's going to be having a segment like this, mm -hmm. exactly mm -hmm. the same thing. Everything was going great until insert bad thing happened to me, and now everything is bad, and I need your help. So yeah, this is this is nothing new, but I'm uh, I'm pretty sure somewhere down the line he's gonna be facing another bankruptcy. Maybe not go through it, but he's gonna get damn near close. Mm. And then we'll have yeah. another bankruptcy, guys. I, guys, I really didn't like doing the bankruptcy, and I'm kind of looking that way again. So mm. uh, you know what I'm saying? Hint, hint. <laughs> now, guys, <laughs> you know that's that's what it was. It was him talking about Mario, and he was like, uh, for some reason, this is, you know, this has happened before with Mario, where <laughs> I've been playing it, and then all of a sudden, the the, uh, the support dropped off, and everyone lost interest, and I'm like, you know, do, do, do people just not like Mario? Is it, you know, missing the forest for the trees kind of thing? Mm. Um, but he says that about everything. It's like, you know, I'm sure he said it about, like, Skyrim and whatever. I'm sure that every single game he's ever played, he's like, I just don't know what it is. You guys are just, just seem to be losing interest. And then he has a good stream and it's like, oh, you must be loving it again. I must have, you know. <laughs> just... oh, uh, uh, <clears throat> let's not forget, by the way, he said he's so important to play this Alan Wake. When the, guy, when the tech is done and fixes the problem, which I, I'm 100% confident he will be able to, you think he's going to play Alan Wake after that? Oh, no, fuck no. He's got to tell you the story of the tech visiting for two hours. <laughs> Don't think you oh, get yeah. Alan Wake. <laughs> I got to tell you yeah. about what happened. That's the so thing. This guy like, shows he's... up. 
Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> is, is this going to be part of Phil's day off, or is there going to be an, an entire stream dedicated to talking about it? That's a good, that's a good question. Yeah. Dude, we're going to hear about it. The guy comes at 12.01. It's going to be like, of course, they don't show at the earliest time. Okay, so then he's here, and then he walks in. He's like, he's not wearing, like, repair garb. I mean, he was wearing, like, normal clothes. You know, we got to hear all those details. And in the end, Phil's going to help. The guy's going to agree with Phil that Comcast sucks. And then the problem's going to be solved. And, of course, Phil helped him fix the problem. That's 100% what's going to happen tomorrow, in my yeah. opinion. Mm-hmm. You know? But anyways, let's get to the contributions here real quick, and then we'll get to the messages we went that that was fun though new style show spontaneous style react uh we got lima whiskey in the house with the burger sam can can we get a burger for that we got the burger super sticker yep cheeseburgers oh i don't have a cheeseburger (laughs) boat night says oh this episode 69 by the way big ups that is nice oh yeah covid 1984 says the bag for a new pc has begun I don't think it's a, it's more of a general bag. I think, don't you think? I, I don't think that was a PC bag in particular. He didn't mention the PC fucking up that much. It was more of a general. Yeah, yeah I agree. This isn't the PC either, is it? This is the laptop. The, lap, so. the laptop. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Lubos Mally says Comcast will offer to rewire his entire house like the car repair people did. That business rewire gold package for businesses. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> they said he'd rewire my whole house for three grand. I was like, hey, it's a good deal. So you know, they don't do anything and Phil pays them. Reno Ryan says they, this. Will... <laughs> go ahead. Right, go. Uh, they should offer him uh, a backup third line of internet. That, that <laughs> yeah. should go over well. Oh yeah, many. It's like many a fallback. Detail there. Mini detail. He said two bit high level business lines. So I know he always lies like that. It doesn't mean that's actually the truth. He does do that a lot. Uh, but he did say two high level business lines, even though previously he's announced he's had one business line and one normal line. But he says lies like that, like like mm. air. So it doesn't mean anything. But um, it, it's it's kind of yeah. weird having high level business lines for a level one business. That oh, yeah. just doesn't make much sense. <laughs> So, uh, Rena Ryan says, this won't work for me today. It's my day off. Can you reschedule when I'm streaming or when it's the most conv- inconvenient time? Definitely. D-Dog says, key, key thing, chat, and guys, he has internet, just no Wi-Fi. He, he was streaming and uploads these videos. Yeah, definitely. So, yeah, he can do whatever he, he can do all he needs. He just cannot get on that goddamn laptop. That's it. But that's it. Um, the Prophet yeah. says, the, the tech will power cycle the modem and then leave. <laughs> Go ahead, Sam. He, well, I was just going to say he can he can actually do the thing he's supposedly passionate about, which is playing games, but he mm-hmm. can't look at the contributions in the chat. You know, it's yeah. Yeah, he makes... has internet, just not Wi-Fi, sleepy. Yeah, just not Wi-Fi. That's it. That's uh, and Logan, awesome. last one in the house says, in the time it took him to record and upload this, a technician could have fixed it. He just wants to sit around and be helpless. Absolutely true. That's the crux of it. He has yeah. to have a problem going on. He has to be begging, like Sir Keem said or Sir Star said. He is addicted to this. He is addicted yeah. to being the victim. And now he's got a real chance to be one, and he's going to take full advantage of it and let you know about it so you can stop him from having problems, guys. Um, but big ups, everybody. Uh, now, guys, last thing before we get to the show. I forgot about this. We have a in the P.O. box down below. We were sent something, and I want to do a lifestyle. Well, not a lifestyle. I did open it, but I haven't seen it yet. This is from the Snort Exchange legend. Snort Exchange runner. Uh, he's a true little legend, and he sent me this. I don't know what I don't know what kind of hat it is. I know it's a hat because it's from the hat store. But we have a hat here. I'm gonna show it on the camera. We have a hat here. Taking it out of the bag. The hat is. I'm gonna see it the first time, the same time you guys do. I want to see this. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. The Snort Exchange oh, hat wow. in the house. Yeah. Legendary stuff there. Happy to show this all day. I did uh, send the markets down a, a good ways last week, but this is this I I, I will wear this happily. It is a uh, penance here. Thank you so much. Snort exchange in the house. Awesome. Very this will nice. be worn on Sunday. Legendary stuff. Thanks, man. That's awesome, dude. Uh, this is a treasure for me. You know, you fucking know that. Awesome. Gonna be in the wall, and I wear it next stream. You're legend. Thanks, guys. Thanks, man. That's awesome. Yeah, can we say that we're sponsored by the Snort Exchange now, since they're sending us merch? Yes. Okay. Nice. I, I say yes. And also, also can I, can that yeah, be purchased good. as well? Oh yes, I don't know. Yeah. You tell me. You tell me, uh, Snort Exchange. We'll link it. Also, we have a member, and I have a member on WPIG that's called Curls and Twirls. So I say I'm sponsored by Curls and Twirls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Big ups. <laughs> All right, let's go, Sam. Let's get to the normally scheduled show. We've had a lot of fun so far. A lot of time left. Let's roll. Okay. Um, right. 
we do have a lot of messages right uh let's start with let's start with kaiser go on yeah hello sirs kaiser augustus on behalf of the dinner world order here i'm just calling in to say that i have reported alt uh, to the United States Securities and Exchange Commission <laughs> due to insider trading of a divorce coin. Uh, also, what's for dinner? Wow, thank you. I've got, I've, I've been, I have a lot of people at my door recently. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> Thanks, Kaiser. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Let's hear from Big Guy. Hey, guys. So Phil recently admitted that he's kept three years worth of styrofoam garbage in his garage. And he's storing that next to the several months worth of cat shit. He also keeps <laughs> in the garage. He's apparently got so much garbage. He can't change a light bulb in the garage. Mm -hmm. Yep. I don't want to even imagine what that place smells like right now. How many industrial strength air fresheners do you think he has now? <laughs> I also can't imagine what his car smells like as he tried to stuff a dozen bags worth of month-old cat shit and year-old DoorDash containers into his car. <laughs> He's got a completely broken bathroom in a 2.5 bathroom house, no central <laughs> air conditioning, an ant infestation, a pet cat that throws up on his bed once a month. I'm not yet buying divorce coin, mostly because cat's only other option is literally to be homeless with their sister in the back of a van. Mm -hmm. But at what point should we be worried that cat smothers Phil in his sleep? <laughs> God. <laughs> you shouldn't be worried. You should be excited. You should be hyped. <laughs> yeah. We, uh, uh, I did the stream about the garage last week and uh, Phil said he got two industrial strength, uh, you know, odor reducers or whatever or, or whatever <laughs> air fresheners Are and they're literally plastic me? and he said he said you have to change him every month right you have to change him every month <laughs> six years later those same motherfuckers are right there <laughs> they're plastic just caught up there <laughs> you get them at the fucking dollar tree dollar tree air uh, fresheners he said they're industrial strength also yeah were, like i thought yeah, big guy was ahead. joking about air fresheners no, that's i didn't all know true. that was a and also oh, this he said he, Phil cannot change the he could not change the light bulb in the garage. Why? Because the styrofoam was stacked too high. How high is that? You know how big a garage is? They were stacked up that high. They <laughs> they don't they they do not cook ever. It is that's pure DoorDash day after day. Oh my god. Imagine it stacked that high. He has one car in a two car garage and it was stacked that high. Fucking hell, man! Nice. Oh, amazing. Jesus, amazing. <laughs> like if he was like a teenager, and he's like, you know, he was just like, he suddenly became massive on YouTube. He's streaming all the time, and he's got his own house. He just moved out from his parents' house, and he's like constantly streaming. Uh, fuck it, DoorDash. You know, I, well, I can yeah, kind yeah. of see it. Like you see, I see that that guy on like. YouTube shorts is like he's got like fucking mold in all the cups around him, and it's oh, like oh yeah yeah you know yeah. that Minecraft or whatever yeah yeah whatever Minecraft that is or Roblox or streamers or whatever yeah I got yeah it. and it's like this fucking things growing in his rubbish on his floor whatever um I, you, like you can kind of see it because they're like younger you know this is like a forty year old dude he's supposedly in this like mature marriage and it's just <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> big ups dark city phil says garbage is also covered in insect killing spray yeah <laughs> rather than take out the trash let's spray it with insect killing spray sound good <laughs> i have a question going back to the air freshener thing ah uh, yes which industry needs an industrial strength air freshener like what and are you trying to and how, side, how do they work what does it look big, like by the way. it's this big this big and it's plastic and yeah, so I don't know what kind of industries need this size of air fresh. This is a candle, but you know, it's an air freshener this big, made of plastic that you just stick on the wall. Nothing attached to it. It's just I just a have this. Tree. Yeah, but it, that, it's it's nothing like this, right? Is this the industrial air freshener? No, no, that's better. That's even better. That's more expensive than what Phil was using. I guarantee it. And he says we got to change it out every month. Never changed it. Never changed it once. I guess we yeah, have morgues, funeral homes, those kind of places. Oh yeah, <laughs> right. 
You walk in and they're like hanging on the ceiling. <laughs> it adds to the vibe. Is it um and, is yeah. it seven where one of the in like one of the killers um it might be the the one where the guy's not dead yet he's like on the bed and he's like all like like almost oh, dead but he's yeah, been yeah. kept alive and there's like air fresheners hanging from the ceiling like loads yep. of those uh, car tree things yeah it sounds this is what it sounds like to me <laughs> in which uh, which movie seven, seven. <clears throat> oh seven yes yeah okay. yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's one of my favorite movies, dude. Yeah, my it's favorite great, movies. great film. Awesome. David Fincher, um, yeah. pretty good. And remember, Phil made fun of Asmongold for being a hoarder. And yeah, Asmongold's house does get crazy, but Asmongold is making millions. And uh, he's single, making millions, uh, you know, streaming every fucking day, like doesn't stop streaming when he's streaming. I know he takes time off and shit, but like, and he called Asmongold a hoarder. You know, Asmongold can pay for a fucking cleaner to come in there every fucking day if he wants to. And Phil can too, Pete, let's get real. But, you know... <laughs> But yeah, let's call Asmongold Asmongold a hoarder for sure. Hmm. I don't. I, yeah, I, I don't think. I don't know. Would you call DSP a hoarder, or is he just lazy? Like, is no, there a lazy. difference? Uh, yeah, you know. just lazy. Just lazy. Yeah. Asmongold right. has a good relationship with his dad. It's true. <laughs> his friends. <laughs> Asmongold is so, is on level a thousand. We're comparing. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> We're not comparing. Hope we're not comparing those two. I wouldn't even yeah. suggest comparing. There's no comparison. His I reacts feel... are better too. They're not oh, great, God. but they're. Yeah. I mean, much better than DSP reacts. <laughs> I, f I feel like with the, the chat talking about hoarding and being lazy, like the difference. I feel like hoarders are like like purposefully hoarding. Like there's a there's a thing where they're like you know, I am doing this for a reason. Whereas laziness is just like it's just laziness. You know. I feel like yeah. A... Yeah. Go ahead. No, that's it. That's all. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think hoarders hoarded because they think for everything that they have, they can find some kind of a purpose. So they just throw it on a pile and it just piles up. Yeah, yeah. I think so. I think there's a different. Yeah, Phil, yeah, was... Phil, 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 go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> uh, Yeah, there was a show about the UK hoarders on YouTube that I watched that they basically work like that. The whole show is like cleaning out their houses. But yeah. yeah, anyways. Mm. And it really, it's like Phil explained very clearly the laziness. He explained it on the stream. He said, and start. They used to do every two weeks. He would take out the take the styrofoam to the styrofoam processing plant, but then when COVID ha happened, they stopped doing it. And they said that threw that threw him and Cat out of their rhythm. So instead of going, they just stopped going. If that's not laziness, I don't know what else is. Mm, that's just yeah. for the styrofoam, though. But I mean, it it, it show, tells a bigger paints a bigger picture there. <laughs> But unbelievable anyway. anyway oh god yeah. don't give me uh, don't give me started on that fucking last last night's comment of phil saying uh why, why don't you guys why don't you do something with cat uh no we don't have internet what can we do that's that's <laughs> unbelievable Dude. that that, that though uh, literal words that came out of his mouth um fucking believable man on what kind we'll, of we'll, we'll say that for something go ahead sam we'll go ahead go ahead we'll play well, the clip that... on sunday get deep but yeah. yeah go ahead that's one for like, it'd be good to have Steve around for, man. I'm yeah, sure he'd be going insane about that. Uh, like, last time he didn't have internet, they went to like Costco or something. Oh, Bed Bath and Beyond, that was Bed, it. Bed Bath and Beyond, hype. So hype I mean, obviously he found out something to do when he doesn't have internet. But yeah, you know it's DSP. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, yeah, okay, yeah, he's got a shitload of Blu-rays, or does he anymore? We don't know. He has said he's got rid of them, hasn't he? Yeah, he has some. Did he say that? Okay. So I'm sure, anyway, there's, there's things he could do, board games, you know, the, the, the one thing we're not mentioning. Anyway, we'll talk about it on yeah. Sunday. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff you could do with your person who's supposed to be your soulmate. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, you got to kill time. Uh, anyway, Fiona oh, yeah. Hall says real quick, but DSP is basically single. Let's be honest. He even said, what would he even talk about without cat, with, with cat, without internet? No point at all without internet. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly what he was talking about. You made me think about it, Fiona Hall. But go ahead, Sam. I was gonna say play a fucking game offline is another thing as well. Like anything, play Skyrim together, hold hands and play Skyrim together. I don't know. Hold hands? You what are you nuts? You operate a household? <laughs> <laughs> With one crazy? hand on the controller each, you know, just to make it interesting. <laughs> right. Uh so, well, last contribution, then we'll keep going. Soul two one seven says, I'm on teams couples counseling. No, afraid not. Afraid not, Saul. But I'll keep reading. Cat would force Phil to go, and Phil would hate paying for it. And hearing their therapist telling him he is at fault, 
Phil would never, ever go close to a place where someone could tell him about his faults. Zero chance. Oh, no. Because he doesn't have any, obviously. Yeah, thank you, thank you. He, he used to be a fallible human, and then he ironed out all his flaws, all his addictions, everything that's in the past now. Now it's new Phil. <laughs> Holding hands? That's over-the-top sexual content. Yes, Jester, please. Oh, I'm married. We can't hold hands. Oh, yeah, we're married. I can't hold hands. <laughs> he would throw oh, out the excuse of being married and then like, oh, yeah, that's my wife. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. Like, can he, is he like prudish around his wife? Like, that's that's a weird one to get into. You've seen the arm, the arm, the, the, the arm around video. That shows you all <laughs> you need to fucking know. Does what if... It, uh... <laughs> What if it's like Michael Scott in the office when when Jan was so like super sexual, she scared the shit out of him and he never had any desire to like get close. What if Cass That's... just like constantly twerking, like super sexualized? <laughs> she won that Italian sausage 24 seven and he's just like tired. He's like old. His back hurt. He can't do it anymore. <laughs> You're describing Leanna, sir. I was just going to say, yeah, it uh... sounds like Leanna. <laughs> You're describing Leanna. So maybe he's <laughs> still scared from Leanna. <laughs> yeah. Cat's best catchphrase is, I haven't had sex in ages. That's yes. my favorite. Uh, okay, right. I feel like this is pertinent to, to, to his profit. Hey, guys. just wanted to say that yesterday's Comcast stuff. Yeah, I LOL'd. That's all. No, it isn't. This is fucking bullshit, okay? This is probably the highest regarded stream I have ever watched in my life. It was funny for about 30 minutes, and then it just got sad the longer it went on. <laughs> Phil lied, right? He made up some story that he contacted Comcast. Comcast wanted them to reset the modem. He refused. Then he was attached to each modem somehow, and he was online, and he was offline. Then he didn't want a hotspot with his cell phone, which would have shown if it was an issue with either his PC or with his uh, fucking internet. But he refused, right? Because Phil knows more, but he's sitting there on a stream asking people for help and then refusing to do it. Like, he doesn't even know what admin privileges are. Like, that is so fucking regarded. Oh, my God. Yeah. I'll have a video up on it because this is like, I'll, I'll, I'll show how, to, how easy it was to fix the problem. It, it wasn't a DNS issue with Comcast. Comcast did not have any outages in Renton yesterday. Okay. Like, this is just, this is great. That's all I wanted to say. Oh, one last thing. What's for dinner? Oh, because profits on that team too? When did that happen? <laughs> when do you join the team? Son of a bitch. <laughs> but yeah, so that, that's interesting though. So Profit says it wasn't an outage there, so it is a fill issue. And mm. but like you said, the stream was very, very interest, very um, very sad, is the right way to say it. Where he would ask for help, not do any of that help, explain why the help he was asking for is stupid, and then Wait for yeah. tips. <laughs> Wait for the tips to roll in. That's that's literally all it is. Like, oh. there's no one on our, uh, no one else on earth that loves having this level of shit to talk. Like, this, he loves having something to talk about, but he has nothing to talk about. So when something like this happens, he's like, yes, I can, <laughs> and he can milk it as well because it's affecting his business. So it's perfect. Yeah, and uh, he wasn't very happy to blow bubbles. We have the, oh. the clip of oh, that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pissed bubble blow. Angry bubble yeah. blow. Every, every, did you send the link for that one? I, uh, I yeah, did, yeah, yeah, yeah. I did see it earlier, but I've, I want to see it again. Uh, right, hang on. Bear with me, everybody. It's going to pop down to the bottom of this Discord. <laughs> and uh, No, actually, I'll play something and I'll get it ready. Uh, here is Ooh, what am i gonna play super chuffer in the house hello hello that being said it's super chuffer from that battery exhausted channel a fun question for you today <laughs> ready with the pause button yes alexander the great charlemagne king henry the eighth and philip bernal alexander the great charlemagne king henry the eighth and philip bernal what do they all have in common hit Gal. pause okay right I think so that's the big out. Yeah. Oh, yes, it is. It's gout. Yeah, it's like the king's disease or something, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> right. This is like a trick question. But... 
now. <laughs> and we're back. Yes, of course, you got that right. They're all cunts. <laughs> <laughs> right, you'd be good. Of course, yeah, they've all got gout. They've all got gout. Hey. You'd be good. And if you can't be good, you're naughty. Yeah, there we go. That's the that's the good catchphrase. Looking for that. <laughs> ALT's old pals. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> my old friends. My high school buddies. <laughs> the only other thing it might have been was might you know, might have been something to do with killing your wife, but Oh, oh God! Henry VIII. Yeah, my second guess was they put they stuffed their wife in the garbage disposal, but I didn't. I thought Gat was a better answer. <laughs> Gat was simpler. Yeah, right. Uh, are you guys seeing that? Yeah, here we go. Right, this is fucking great. There you go. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that for a freeze frame for for a start. I'm not a children's entertainer. Mean <laughs> curator. Fuck out of here. Yeah. What's wrong with you? There you go. Didn't even blow. By the way, just quickly, do you see what I mean about the the weird little like the way he blows bubbles with a massive gap in his is anyway. I'll, I'll show. You. We haven't heard your take on that bubble blow for a while. You got your people don't know what you're talking about. People been explain, bugging about me for an hour for fucking. Yeah, explain your bubbles take real quick. Explain what? your bubbles take because I think people what? don't know that enough. Look at his mouth and like you know like when you blow bubbles, you have a tiny little hot, you go, <laughs> but he's like, his his gobs wide open. Look at it. <laughs> It's just weird. It's just a weird little thing I noticed. I Didn't think maybe Dan... <laughs> there. You got your bubbles. Since people have been bugging about me for an hour for fucking bubbles, when obviously there's more important things. There's the bubbles. Okay. We did the bubbles. I love that jowl <laughs> shake as well. That needs to be a thing. Look at that. I think that's something that someone in the same profession as you would notice that maybe normal people would not notice, Sam. Yeah, maybe. You know, it maybe. happens. You're used to that. <laughs> Look at oh, <him>. God. <laughs> oh God! Oh <laughs> God! He's having flashbacks. Joe, big ups. Jim Farm in the house says, as a network engineer for an internet service provider, after rebooting modem and router, I would use command prompt to trace route the IPS for DNS server on Comcast and Google's IPs and see where it breaks. Use ATT public server to ping back towards. Well, that's probably what he's gonna do. Thanks so much for that contribution. That's very meaningful, sir. Damn, but, uh, thank we'll, you very much. That's very meaningful. We'll see if it has it. We'll see if what happens tomorrow, but Phil's going to somehow solve it himself, I bet. That's what we're going to hear, but you're probably right. Yeah, he didn't know what com command prompt was, by the way. Yeah, he didn't know what that was. What? He didn't know what command prompt meant. Dude, come on. But he's good. Yeah, <laughs> Phil would say, I already tried that, moron. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I already tried that. Of course you are, Phil. <clears throat> right. What's ping? I was saying ping. <laughs> ping. I was saying ping. I ping. <laughs> Is that racist term? I was gonna say. <laughs> what I say? I ching. Like that's something real. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know. Talk about yeah. uh stereotypical Chinese names. I ching. Right. Asshole. Oh. Uh, uh, I forgot to say, today I got to clock out a little bit early. So in about like 15 minutes. Okay. okay. Yeah, no just so I know. I want to hear it now. The Book of Changes, I Ching. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. It's a book, obviously it's supposed to be Asian. The name of the author was <laughs> I Ching. I Ching Chang Chong. I Ching Yi Chang Charlie Chan. Are you kidding me? It's the most generic racist thing ever. I Ching. <laughs> He makes it racist. He turns it racist. <laughs> ah, Chin Chang, Charlie Chang. <laughs> oh, fucking it's like, I, this clip is fucking an all time great. It's a classic. There's so many levels of like DSP isms in it. I love it. I, I can't remember. I, I think I found that. <clears throat> Obviously, it was probably well known before I found it, but like I, I was looking for something else and then like stumbled upon that. Like. <laughs> Oh, people are asking for it again. We got to hear it again. One more well, time. One more time. Th that's not the only one. That's not the only oh. time it's happened. Amazingly. Okay. There's like two other clips here. I haven't heard these for a while, but that one, that one's the best, I think. Here we go. The fuck is that? What is an I Ching coin? <laughs> Some stupid character related item. <laughs> There's that one. I feel like that might have been from, um, it was like a shooter. It might have been like uh, PUBG or something, that one. But anyway. Here's the other one. I Ching tarot cards. 
Yeah, that was, that was the other <laughs> He's one. Yeah. I-Ching a lot, actually. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's like that. What was that other thing he said recently? And then he, we found the exact same clip from like three years ago or something. Oh, fuck. Something... What was that? I know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. Dude, anyway. play the classic. Uh, the we got to hear the standard. Classic. Oh, you want to hear the standard? bog? Yeah, yeah, bog standard. Bog, that was it. Yes. Right. Here's the good one. The book of changes. I-Ching. <laughs> Come on. It's a book. Obviously, it's supposed to be Asian. The name of the author was I Ching. I Ching Chang Chong. I Ching Yi Chang Charlie Chan. Are you kidding me? It's the most generic racist thing ever. I Ching. He, he adds so much, like so smoothly. Like it just yeah. rolls off the tongue. I Ching Chang. I Ching Chang Charlie Chang. Like, why are you saying Charlie? <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's almost like he's offended at how basic this racism is. He's, like, so racist <laughs> that he's offended that somebody can even bring up something that is so, like, transparently yeah. just generically racist. He's, like, you know, competitive you're... racism. <laughs> yeah. You know who you're talking to? This is Phil Burdell, motherfucker. I bring the yeah. heat. I ching, chang, Charlie, chang. Chicka, chaka, chow. Yeah, you've got, to do, Chicken... you've got to do better with your racism, man. <laughs> Uh, for anyone interested, that is from a game called Tacoma. From uh, tw his playthrough was 2017, um, and it's episode 11. If you're interested, uh, that was different. That was a character, though, guys. Remember, it that was, was a character. Character. Yeah, character. Sure. All character. Right. Okay. Oh, do you got to do that one called "Like Some Rice," Sam? Yeah, and this is from two weeks ago. So uh, yeah, let's see. Right. We'll, we'll find out what happened then. What's up, that being said, it's like some rice. Just wanted to see how Steve was doing, if he's there. Hey, Steve, I hope you're feeling better. If not, also, hey, Steve, hope you're feeling better, if you hear this. Uh, just wanted to say, guys, so Phil has been on a massive beg stream, and just, he hasn't fucking stopped begging at all lately. And it got me thinking, Phil is really trying to justify his begging, which kind of begs the question, <laughs> begs the question. <laughs> it got me thinking, has Phil ever done anything positive that people can look back to and say, yeah, you know, Phil actually did something meaningful and improved somebody's life with either something, not even just content, but like saying something nice to somebody or doing something nice and meaningful uh, just curious, can you think of a time where Phil did something actually good for somebody else that wasn't to suit, to satisfy his own needs? Would love to hear what you guys think. Love the show. Thank you so much. And uh, yeah, uh, team divorce all the way. Sucks all in that. Take care, guys. Good question. Uh, has, that's a good, great question. Great question. Because I can't think of it. Uh, I was trying to think the... if there was, there was one that you always say, but I think it's just that he it's either he's a he's a somewhat decent fighting game player which i don't i don't know if i agree with um i think the question was more did he help someone yeah. without getting something back so yeah like, so he, yeah i was just trying to think of any time that any one of us has somewhat you know praised him for anything you know oh nice things about him oh that's tough that's tough yeah. i mean back in the street fighter days some people said he's okay but like it's never like yeah, yeah feels good it's like yeah okay feels okay you know it's like that uh, yeah. It's never like, yeah, it feels great. It's not like that. This, but I think I ever... Yeah, go I'll ahead. Go on then. Yeah, so um, some time ago, there was a tweet that I remember that DSP replied to uh, about some kind of a charity campaign that he participated in. And then the guy organizing it didn't like him. And DSP brought it up on Twitter. Hey, man, you you know, you were nice to me when I donated to that charity campaign. And now you seem to have something out for me. You know, what's up with that? So basically he did, he was a part of some charity campaign for some GoFundMe or something, I think. And mm -hmm. then he kind of burned out all that goodwill that he got from that by bringing it up to like make it kind of like a point why yeah. somebody should like him. And when you do that, you kind of look like an asshole. So yeah, th that's the closest I could get. <laughs> It's it's yeah. tough because you're right. Like if he does something, he says he shares he would, it, and then yeah. we could you could argue that he's getting it to make himself look better. Like yeah, he did give a waiter a big tip one time, and it changed the waiter's life. Remember that story? Oh, he That's was crying. Classic. Yeah, yeah, we turned the classic there. Uh, he did bring donuts one time to a Street Fighter tournament when he was uh, uh, late teens. One time, don't <laughs> I mean, lie. 
<laughs> when when he was out there getting uh, racking up big credit card debts, he was making a lot of people happy by giving him money and mm-hmm. like paying for their lunch, dinner, whatever. They were being driven around and stuff uh, back in the FGC. So I guess people took advantage of him and they got some benefit out of it. I guess this is where we end with him being beneficial to people and doing good stuff. Holy yeah. shit, man. This chat is going nuts right now. Chat is on fire right now. Oh, what? Uh, Bo- that, Boat Knight says, yeah. <laughs> Boat Knight says, remember, DSP took in a child and raised her. <laughs> oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> I was going to say, I thought for a second, you know, it flashed in my mind, like, oh, yeah, he helped the cat. But I was like, no, that cost two grand. <laughs> That was that was direct direct receiving something. Uh but fuck man. A Day says with as dumb and racist as Phil is, he has always heard Chinese food is made with cat. Team wife is stir oh god. I'll say it again. With as dumb and racist as Phil is, he has always heard Chinese food is made with cat. Team wife is stir fry. Oh god. Come on, you can't be saying that. <laughs> uh, Jim Farm in the house says Charlie Chan is a character in black and white movies. Oh, yeah. so yeah. but is that some kind of character that people know? And you think Phil's calling out Charlie Chan? Do you, no, Jim? No, I, he's just been a racist dickhead. Um, uh, also, I mean, yeah, it should it should be said it should be said as well. Yes, we know that the I Ching is a real thing as well. I know that like it Oh influenced... yeah, we know it's real. Yeah. We yeah, know yeah, it's yeah. real by the way. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it was a huge thing in like the 60s. It was it was um influencing people a lot it, it, with the, you know. Yeah. I know it's the, sometimes tough. Yeah. Drug usage as well, you know. There was oh. a lot of that going on. I know sometimes when like we're I know it sometimes feels weird when I'm like, I am racist, but I'm just saying what Philip said, you know, mm-hmm. <laughs> but I know it's sometimes it might not feel that way, but yes. Uh, Vike says Phil's charity is silent group debunked. You're right about that. His charity is silent. So maybe if he follows his own mantra, we never hear about it because it is silent, but uh, you can believe that or not as you wish. All right, Samuel, let's do another one. But with any anyone though, like surely any other streamer or person in general, you would think you'd be able to say, "Oh, I did that one thing once, and it was really cool." Like, there's you would definitely have no trouble f- saying that about anyone, I would imagine. Yep. But with Phil, we're having to really like scratch our heads and go, hmm, there, "There was this one thing he did on Twitter once, which was kind of all right, you know." <laughs> and other than that, it's, it's there's nothing. Anyway. Uh, utterly insane. Here we go. Hey guys, Otter here. Just wanted to, to say that a lot of people are saying that uh, Phil is asking for ID from people to make them mods. I just wanted to know what you thought of that. And also, how long do you think that it's going to be before one of the new mods bans Derish or times him out for a period of time for his incessant crap? Thank you. Love the show. Meaningful curated content as always. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> Big ups, Adelie Insane. So we yes. have about the ID thing. I think it's just like a fear tactic. Like, I have this on you, bitch. So if you turn on me, I got your ID, motherfucker. It's like mm. a scare tactic, but I don't know. What do you guys do you think, think it's that? happening? Oh, I don't think it. I don't, I, I, he said that, right? I think he said he was going to do that. Right? Really? Get, I thought he said, I'm going to get the IDs of people. Like, I, maybe I need the IDs of people. It wasn't like guaranteed. It was kind of like, Maybe I need to get the IDs of people. I don't know. But I think if he what, does that, it's kind of like to scare them, a scare tactic. But what kind of a person you got to be to send some dude your fucking ID or driver's license so he can be a mod in his chat? Or for yeah. any reasons whatsoever, to send him some asshole on the internet? Well, DSP. What? DSP fan, right? I mean, they will. Some DSP fans would absolutely do that. Absolutely. Without even a second thought. Got it. Daddy asked and, for this, so I got to do this. Daddy. How, how is he going to use that against them? What if they go out and they ban everybody? What is he going to do? He's going to just but, dox them? He's going to post their driver's license on Twitter? That's, a, that's what I'm saying. It's just a, fi- a scare tactic, I think. It's a scare tactic that he can't go anywhere. He can't do anything with it, but he's just trying to... Because he thinks that's kind of scary to people, right? I'll, I'll dax you. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. Who, who cares, you know? But I think it's just a scare tactic in his mind. But I don't know. Yeah, I don't think he's doing that at all, but uh, it would be really funny if he did. And I wouldn't actually be surprised. I don't think he's doing it. I would never be surprised if he did it because he's super paranoid. And at this point, who is he going to find to be his mod? Who's going to be up for it? There's three uh, candidates. And one of them already is. So there's two candidates. Uh, I'm not sure who is. I think 
Jade is now. So we have Slayer or Derek. Those are your two options. So oh, dude, okay. <laughs> I mean, not even OIC wouldn't do it. He's never there. He's rarely there, I should say. What's that from? Sorry, I'm just uh, staring at chat here. What's? Are you scared where you shouldn't be or where you should be? Is that a quote from like a uh, Ghost Hunters or something? Someone's just said, are you scared where well, you shouldn't be? You're on scare tactics. No, that's a quote from like a US <laughs> show or something in it. That. Sorry, I was just completely derailing the conversation. But yeah. Snoot says Star Wars. Bat Someone says Batman. Look, everyone's saying everything. Look at this. Star Wars, Yoda. Okay, it's an actual show called Scare Tactics. All right. Well, I don't know. Oh, yeah, it's on Scare Tactics. Oh, we got, oh okay. Blue has a question here. This is a good comment. I think we should drop the moniker of Soul Maid for Cat because she does, doesn't actually clean anything if the garage any indicator. Also, the ant, ant, the ant poison has been up there for a year. I agree. Good point there. Soul Maid she, is not true. Soul Mayor. We should do Soul Mayor. I don't agree with Soul, soul Mayor. Oh, well, you said it. Cat, no, no. I just, I was, I was trying to do what the people want. I don't agree with that <laughs> name myself, but some people might. Not me. But you guys might. You assholes. Now schoolers. <laughs> I don't agree with that name, but go ahead. <laughs> right. Okay. What should we do? Uh, let's hear from, oh, Brad Burnian four hours ago. All right, should be good. Hello, everyone. Brad Burnian here. I'm just at work at the minute. And it, I, I don't know what possessed me, but I've just been listening slash sort of watching uh, Phil's two and a half hour troubleshooting stream. And <laughs> <sighs> God, I know ALT has said it before in, in the past, but he, he he truly is Phil. Sorry, Phil is Phil is truly <laughs> the worst content creator on not just on YouTube but on any platform. Like two and a half hours. I'm not finished yet. I'm not. I'm not gonna finish it because why the fuck would I? But two and a half hours of if, if I'm understanding correctly, there was a problem with the Comcast, so the internet was down. So that that's it, isn't it? Isn't that just why? Why are you trying to? So, there's nothing you can do, presumably. I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, feel free to yell at me. But, you know, if it's a problem on Comcast ends, then that's it. It's a shame, but oh well, there's not much you can do, you know. Just get on with it. Just bloody spend some time with, you know, your your beloved cat or whatever. And your feline cat. You know, just do, just do something. Instead of sitting, whinging to people about... And, and having a go at anyone that makes suggestions. To actually try and help, and he just laughs at them and says, oh, oh, oh. You know, uh, oh, I don't know. But anyway, okay, bye. <laughs> Brad Birdie in the house. <laughs> Angry. Anger coming through the phone line. Uh, but yeah, you're I right. Like I it. mean, we all said uh, it. Go ahead. <laughs> I, I like it when people send us messages just to vent about <laughs> yeah. how annoying yeah, yeah. this dude is. <laughs> I gotta call. I gotta call that being said real quick. I'll just leave it out. <laughs> Just the way he talks just gets to me, man. It's just like the way he delivers. Like, I don't know. He's great. But um, yes, he's the worst. He's the absolute worst. I agree. Um, he doesn't, he doesn't quite, he doesn't get it. He doesn't get the point of all this. He doesn't know how to best present himself or how to present content. He thinks he does, but he, he takes, or I don't know. He takes a situation and looks at it completely wrong and then detractors come along and take that and make something out of it. He is, mm -hmm. like we say, like Shinko says, you know, he's the, he's the catalyst. He's a content catalyst. Um, but he has no idea about that. He, he doesn't know. He doesn't get it at all. You know, he thinks people legitimately care about a 15 minute video uh, of, of an update, uh, you know, of, of his Internet situation. You know, this is... It's, 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 I mean, <laughs> yeah. In his mind, I'll tell you why he's doing it is because he thinks he can get tips from that. So he'll just sit there and get tips. <laughs> yeah, that's what he wants. I mean, that's all. That's all it is. He told you many times, "I'm not getting as many tips as I normally would get on the nighttime stream." Well, <laughs> okay. I mean, at least thanks for being honest. But I mean, come on, man. <laughs> that is absolutely complaining about your income based on the people that give you that income. Yeah, yeah. but hey. Just being honest, being honest and transparent, everybody. That's all I can do. Just uh, everything he says can be summed up in fucking uh, in two minutes and then on to gameplay. Done. Unless there's something like. Oh, yeah. You reminded me. We got to cover that, by the way. The tweet, the time tweet. 
Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. that's perfect segue. Perfect yeah, exactly. segue. Sweet. Yeah. So yeah, from the, Gout Gout. What's yeah. his name? Yeah, that's, oh that's his yes, name. this is Gout, good. Gout. So good. Mirka, you're the you're the you're the presenter here. Go ahead. Uh I don't have it. <laughs> oh Jesus. That's it, you guys. Hope you liked it. <laughs> All right, so oh, I got I'll it. do it. Or, yeah, yeah, go ahead, Sam. You're the presenter. Go ahead, Sam. So okay, yeah. So Gout Gout puts out these little uh audits uh weekly. Yeah, Daily. work week. Daily and weekly. So okay. bonus. I'll give the I'll give the link in chat for anyone who wants to follow him. Please follow this person so they keep doing it because it's really good. But go ahead. Okay, so yeah, this yeah. is this is this is a work week. This is this one in particular, uh, from the twentieth to the twenty fifth of this mm -hmm. month. Uh, so setting up of the podcast, a hundred is this? So this is one hundred and fifty two minutes. Yes. Uh, in total, right? Okay, total. twenty five minutes average. Yeah, we just setting up. So this is before. This is this is uh, this is slideshow and music. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Right. And that's him setting up. Presumably looking at Twitter, going shit, shit, shit. I need gaming news or something. <laughs> yeah. What's trending? Yeah. Uh, and then intro, twenty-two minutes. Uh, so that's four percent of uh, of the, so it's four percent of the week of the, of, of the of entire the, week. Yeah. Of the, yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Uh, daily rap recap, 73 minutes, 14%. Daily rap recap. Let's get that straight. 14% of his <laughs> entire content is wrapping up the content for a week. Right, okay. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, schedule, 107 minutes, 21% of your entire content for the week. <laughs> oh, hang on. Okay, so this is podcast audit. Right. This is only podcast. Yeah, this is yeah, only this is a level one podcast. Right, 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 right. Yeah, okay. Level one podcast. Yeah. Even so, twenty one percent of your po your podcasts for, for five days worth of stuff is Jesus Christ. So wait, real quick, real quick, before you move on. So thirty five percent of the level one podcast is either recapping the recap from the day before or telling you about the schedule. Thirty five percent of the podcast <laughs> is those two things. Go ahead, Sam. Keep going. Fucking great. <laughs> the username as well. People are telling me, says so simply saying, <laughs> okay, <laughs> has to be three to five percent. <laughs> That's a fucking legendary LARPer name right there. People are telling me. <laughs> That's too good. People are telling me. <laughs> like not even trying to hide it. <laughs> oh, legend. <laughs> Christ. If you're not right, already ahead. banned from his, his podcast. Oh, just... God, you're banned. You must be banned. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Go ahead uh, right. to the next part. Schedule. Schedule. Okay. Oh, no, sorry. Begging and shout outs. Yeah, so begging and, and shout outs. 84 minutes Oof. is 16%. Uh, so, yeah, real quick, oh, that's before you yeah. move on, Sam, let me tell you. So now we have 35%. Uh, sorry. So we're up to 51% of the podcast is daily rap, schedule, begging and shout outs. <laughs> We so passed, what, what? What was the total percentage we, so far? What, we, what did you just we, say? We, yeah, we just fifty-one percent. We're up fifty-one. To now. So over half of his podcast is yes, begging is, and shout-outs, schedule or daily rap recap. We're up to that fifty-one percent now. Fifty-one percent. Over half of his podcast is talking right, 40, about and then, the podcast and <laughs> yeah, him, yeah. And so his so far, so, so far. far, so far. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck me. Right. Okay. Then we're on to DSP News, oh, which here is we go. Uh, arguably <laughs> maybe the first part of a uh, like the uh, what you would consider to be legit podcast material, I guess. Uh -huh. yep. Like this is what you know. Presumably, if you've got a legit podcast, this is what you are tuning in for. This sort of thing. This yep. is fifty three <laughs> minutes and only ten percent of the podcast for the for the week. <laughs> so he works to get content for ten percent of the show. Yeah. Remember, that's all. That's the only part he needs to get content for because everything else is just talking about what already happened or what is going to happen in the future. Yeah. yeah. And this, no, but this is the <laughs> most amazing one of all. Q and A, one hundred and sixty minutes, thirty one percent is him sitting there waiting for people to ask him stuff. So, so that and there's it's the total adds up to ninety six percent because there's four percent of like extra stuff that you know can put in a category. So listen, to put right. in perspective, okay? So 47, we have 68, we have seven, 82, 86% of the show, 86% of the show about 
86 percent of the show is stuff he doesn't have to prepare for it's just the stuff he goes through every fucking day or he gets questions from the chat 10 percent, which is supposed to be if we're talking in burger terms as someone people appreciate around here the burger should be the dsp news right burger mm -hmm. burger yes that's 10 yeah. percent of the show 10 percent. all the rest all the rest is 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 q a begging schedule daily rap recap amazing yeah. amazing <laughs> it, perfect i love this i really <laughs> love this that this exists because this this completely backs up what i've been thinking for a long time man so yeah incredible I'll put, put all this to good use at some point <clears throat> please please follow that person that, that puts the work in for that because it's got to be a painful job to do that but and oh, yeah all the, the the following the the other four percent has to be complaining i mean what, there's that's probably a higher percent of if that was the category you know complaining about the weather complaining about the air conditioner complaining about games like where does that air. go dead well, air yeah, that's four percent stepping the out to close his window yeah <laughs> Uh, I gotta I mean, go now. By the way, okay. Uh, yep. Nice, uh, nice chat we had. Shout out chat. Shout out uh, on demand audience. Uh, big ups, you guys. I'll see you around next time. Yep. See you Peace. Sunday. In a bit. All right. We'll keep now. We can derail. Full derail. Meerkat dog. <laughs> Party time, <laughs> boys. All right. You know, I really we got twenty minutes left. Let's uh, get to a few more matches. We should play Regis too. We did not play Regis. Regis will revolt if we don't play that, Sam. Okay. Well, we'll do we that now then, I guess. Yeah. Because uh, I have that here, I think. Yeah, it was this jelly donut one, wasn't it? Yeah. So this, yeah, 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 it is. Here it is. Where am I recording? You still haven't told me! Have we heard this? I think we have. <laughs> okay, and welcome to Who Wants to Be a Billionaire? Yeah, we've heard that yeah. one. <laughs> Alright, play a message real the... quick. I'll get the new one. You play okay, play another cool. message. Play uh, Brian S. there is looking hype. And let's get the next one. Okay, here we go. I'll find it. <laughs> well, I just want to say that I've been enjoying the plunge episodes. Um, I was watching the one that uh, was done about DSP's garage and just thought that it would probably be a good show uh, to do a plunge on DSP's green screen. Um, he's talked about having green screens for years and always used it as a selling point for upgrades to the stream and whatnot but never actually apply green screens to his streams so i thought it'd be a cool deep dive to do a show on dsp's green screen lore because he's mentioned it so many times over the year over the years of his career so just something i wanted to put out there oh definitely that's oh. a good idea because there is there's a lot of green screen lore he both begged seriously for the green screen lore and said he can't wait for the green screen to have be up because he gets that new house the new house is going to give me room so much room i can do ddp yoga and i can also do green screen and then you saw the result of that he did set up the green screen once but then left it up for literal years just sitting there in the garage doing nothing uh, because it was Back when you, just to... we used to have space in the garage yeah. uh -huh, before that but the reason he kept it up is it's easier just to keep it up than to take it down when you want to use it so he just kept it up and he got that one video that one video which i feel has been used more than any two. other two? Oh, the green you know like the green screen back and forth oh two parts yeah. excuse me but that 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 those videos have been used in more detractor content than almost anything else yeah i mean there's a Oh, oh, and it makes like... zero sense as to why it exists. It's, it's <laughs> unbelievable. Again, it's just another thing where it's like, why would you put that out? Please, you know, that's the sort of thing you would like. You'd, you'd be like, please don't upload that. Like, <laughs> just or delete immediately if that's me. You know, <laughs> what? I don't uh, get it. Why does uh, that exist? It, you should, if you haven't watched the video itself, um, I recommend watching that video. It's still on his channel, but he's out of breath walking back and forth, and it's kind of funny. And he tried yeah. to think of what to do, and Leanna's there. And yeah, you can hear <laughs> her off the off funny the watch. Side, yeah. yeah, it's a funny watch. I recommend it. But uh, I, I've, I've, yeah. I've never understood the point. Of, like the like, obviously. Whoa, Steve's in the chat. Big ups, big man. ups. Um, I've never understood it. Like what? Like 
it is literally something for him to be able to dangle over people's heads and say like, oh, maybe one day we'll do it. But I don't get what it would add at all. Like, yes, he would be cut out from and he could be overlaid over the top of his gameplay footage. Big deal. Like, you know, it's not the big thing. Also, why it, the, the one he had as well. Why did you have to get the big, like, industrial size one? Like, you know, you could literally get one that's like, you know, you just lift it up and it's there and then you put it down, you know. That would he, be yeah. what he needs. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's just thinking he doesn't know that they exist or something and he just he's thinking, oh, I've got to get, like, a big C-stand in here and, you know. I don't know. Yeah. yeah. By the way, he said that he couldn't do green screen because of copyright issues. Thanks, Barrett Willis, for pointing that out. We heard that on the, on the, on the, uh, the plunge as well. This was after the ops went through where the intro, remember someone copyrighted the, the the intro art and he deleted all those videos? That killed the green screen because he said, what can I do? I can't put anything behind me because people can people can copyright claim that. And that's why he didn't do the green screen. Uh, in addition to being lazy, I think that was his, I think he was lazy, but then that happened. He said, okay, I have a reason that I don't have to use this anymore, so I'm going to fucking use it. And he said that we can't use it because uh, you could get copyright stri stricken for having stuff behind you that you don't own. So. <laughs> and he could, he specifically said he couldn't do games back there because he doesn't own that either. While being a game streamer that is streaming only games, but you can't do that in the green screen for. You tell me reasons. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> he said you could you literally, he said you could not use gaming behind you because he doesn't own that. Right? But he was playing games on his stream every day, but that's fine, but you can't use that because I don't know. <laughs> that makes less than zero sense, man. That's fucking Brand dude, good point too. During house hunting we heard about green screen. And we heard about how this this wall would be good for green screen. It's all, uh, you know how it is. He just wants more mm. stuff. I want to buy new stuff. Doesn't mean I'm going to use it, but I just want more stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I just, I, it, I've never understood it. It would be like, I don't know. I don't know how much they cost, but I'm sure you could get one that's decent, that's like small enough to fill his small, that small piece of his office that you see every day that would lift up and retract. It's it would, so stupid. It would, imagine, it would, imagine the tips. If you tip ten dollars, you get to change the background. People go nuts for that on his stream. I wonder if he just doesn't realize that you don't need, like, oh, I don't know. I don't get how it would change anything. Like he, he, he could just chroma the chroma himself into whatever, like over the top of his gameplay footage. Like I don't get how it would change anything. Like yeah, okay, he he would need something for his podcast, assuming he filmed in front of his green screen on his podcast you would need to have something behind it but why not just all you need is like a blank color or so or anything like what you know I'd... It was, it, it, he would it was, it's never gonna happen because he wants to go through uh i'm going through the hard work of setting up my stream for this month i gotta change the scenery for this month that's it yeah he's i don't get that it, I, he's worried about copyright He's worried about copyright. That was that was a, 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 an additional excuse to not do it. Was copyright? I can't use this copyright, guys. Watch he, it's on the plunge if you haven't seen it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, do it, man. It'd be fascinating. <laughs> like he could just like make something yourself. Then if you're worried about copyright, I don't get it. Don't get it at all. Guys are fucking enigma. It's crazy. <laughs> right. Uh, did we find the? Yeah, we got it. Cool. Got it. Right, Sent to right. DMs, bro. Slid right in there asking for your OBS. Raw. Mm, okay. You need help with your OBS settings? I got the help. <laughs> right. Well, today we learned. Okay. Today we learned. By the way, uh, um, that the first contact, public contact from DSP to to Catherine Burnell, that OBS settings public response. Two weeks later. Two weeks later. The oh, we didn't learn today, but just I was I showed it today again that everyone already knew this. But just in case you didn't know, uh. The first contact from Phil Burnell to Catherine Burnell was one day after he announced that Ka him and Leanna had split up. One day after the twit longer, he publicly talks to, not talks, he responds to, to Kat Burnell on Twitter. Wow. Two weeks later from that, that is when the restraining order is filed against Subaru. Less than two months after that, Catherine Burnell has her first visit, visit to Renton. That's how fast that moved. That fast. Wow. Damn. <laughs> Okay. Apparently, we got a rare shot of the empty office with no mic yesterday. I always like the uh, the little 
peaks like the the good like uh screen grabbable graphics of his like Phil domains over the years. <laughs> it's the sort of thing I would put in the intro to this. Yeah, yeah, stream. yeah. Oh, Roach, Roach Bay's asked quite when did Leanna go to the hospital? Two weeks before two weeks before uh DSP announced that they had broken up, Leanna was in the hospital. Two weeks before that. And he later said she moved out two weeks ago, which I take to believe that hospital trip was the reason she said, fuck it, I can't even live here anymore. They're already broken up, but she said, I can't live here anymore. And that was it. Uh, in terms of timeline, right? It just lines up too perfectly. But anyways. Uh, by the way, I see... It's, uh, who is that? Someone, uh, Ice Cold. Ice Cold G. Yeah, go, rewind the stream. I, I'm not trying to be funny. But rewind the stream. We already went over that. And we, we bro all blew up at that moment. I promise you, my friend. <laughs> I promise you. Okay. So we have, the, we have the latest for Leonardo now. And it's probably not going to play just yet. Oh, it will. Okay, cool. Here we go. Here it is. Hello again and welcome back to Who Wants to Be a Billionaire? You know, it's been a long time coming, but here we are. It's our 15 question episode anniversary. That doesn't count the episodes where we didn't ask questions or we asked questions that didn't have answers. This is the episode where we ask 15 questions or 14 and this is going to be the fifth. You get the idea. Anyway, if I've learned anything from watching Phil, it's been that 15 year anniversaries need to be entirely about you and everyone else can get fucked. So with that in mind, let's ask a question about us. Now, all the way back in January of this year, when I was working for a different helicopter game show, I submitted a question to the SpeakPipe. Now, if you don't know what SpeakPipe is, let me explain. It's a website where people go and they submit 90 second recordings of them screaming into the microphone and these idiots have to play it. So anyway, I had submitted a question to SpeakPipe and I was just doing this for fun. I wasn't even doing it for money yet, but it was a very early <laughs> prototype question of what would later be known as the level one, um, uh, as who wants to be a billionaire. Now, mm. in that very original question, who got points? Was it A, ALT? Was it B, Meerkat? Was it C, Sam? Or was it- Wait, why am I explaining this? There's four of you and there's four options. You know this shit. Just place your bets. D is Steve. You know the drill. It's been 15 questions at this point. I- I don't have to put effort <laughs> in anymore. Who got points the first episode? So can we say Indrid or no? No. <laughs> I don't think she did yet, actually. I, that wasn't a thing yet. No, I, I think it's... Think. I, I, okay, this is... I know I'm setting myself up, but my mem if memory serves, I believe it was Meerkat. That's my okay. guess. Okay. I'm going to say Steve. That's <laughs> my final answer. And Steve thinks it was Meerkat, and it and it wound up ALT. Yeah, because I got pissed. Yeah, because, you know... I wound up... Right, right, right. Sorry. Yeah, he, always gets, he always beats me with these fucking shit, but all right. I'll get him okay. someday. Here we go. Hey, we'll, we'll find out. I literally just said I don't have to put in effort. Why are you waiting for a bit? Okay, and the correct answer is... D and A. Because both Steve oh, and ALT hey. got points. Steve getting full points for guessing correctly, even though he doesn't measure it cups. And ALT for guessing correctly according to how much sugar actually goes into Phil's recipe rather than how much he actually used in that uh. one video. Ah. Originally, I had a whole big speech here talking about, oh, how grateful I am. I was going to try and ape one of Phil's, you know, I can't do it without you guys. But it just didn't work because I was also trying to be genuine and Phil and genuine don't mix. So long story short, I appreciate what you guys do. I know not every question is a winner. You guys still put up with me. You still let me have my little segments. And it's just meaningful as hell. Did I use that right? Meaningful? Anyway, the point is, as thank you for that, everyone gets a point today. Just as long <laughs> as no one brought up injured again. Ah, shit. We brought up injured. We lost. <laughs> That's it for this week, but make sure to tune in next week when we celebrate our 18-question anniversary, because I've arbitrarily decided that if Phil gets to celebrate things for an entire week, then so the hell do I. Big ups. <laughs> Big ups, Regis. Big ups. Legend. All right. We have 10 minutes left, literally 10. Let's get through three more messages. Let's push it. Come on, Sam. Farmless okay. in the house. Farmless, farmless, farmless. farmless. 
Hey there, guys. I'm actually using my proper audio style setup now, so no audio glitches or anything. And nice. yeah, but because I've already bought it, I'm going to need your buy in. So if you guys can come over and uh, tip, I'd appreciate that. Anyway, um, I've been thinking about the mini PC. I know it's old hat now. And I've kind of been like bashing through like a load of old PC games like Quake, Quake 2, the Half-Life, uh, the original trilogy of Half-Life 1 and like Blue Shift, Opposing Force and stuff like that. And I'm like, what's stopping Phil from playing this on the mini PC? Like you can literally just crack open like GOG.com or something. And there'll be like some ye old like PC games, which, you know, have their own emulators or running a DOS box or something which he can just stream like considering that he can't play quote unquote current 3d games but i'm pretty sure any like built-in graphics card can run the original half-life hell maybe even half-life 2 at this point like i don't get it considering he's meant to be the king of retro like why his mind didn't go directly to that kind of thing i don't know but yeah anyway he's played chrono trigger like there's no point in using the mini pc again um I just like your thoughts on the situation, really. There's no way he's going near Half Life again. That's for sure. No, 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 no. Um, Fuck no. Scary. Get the fuck yeah. out of here. What's wrong with you? Gabriel Household? As, as we all know, <laughs> you know, it would be great if he did just to see if it happened again. But uh, anyway. Yeah, there's a billion games out there that he could be playing that, that wouldn't that wouldn't take up you know, that would be more than possible on your, your mini PC. You know, here's the problem yeah. Here, here's the problem he knows his fan base his his fan base does not pay up for those kind of games mm. it's not happening they only he he you know his fans want to see triple a right no it, that's that's how that's how it works out he does get the most money from triple a i think and mm. all his fans want to see the biggest games everyone's talking about they're not going to watch him play you know whatever the fuck half-life one you know it's not it's not going to happen retro is not a thing and he 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 can't play retro games anymore either without massive massive hand holding or saves coming, so that's a risk too, right? You can't. Some of those games are hard as shit. I mean, some mm. of them. You know, yeah, like Half Life well. Two is not a good example. The Half Life's not a good example, but you know what I'm saying. There's games that are hard, and he'll that that he can't be shown as having a tough time unless the game is made to be tough and people like to see him suffer with it, like Dark Souls yeah. or those kind of games. Yeah, I was, my mind went to like like point and click adventure games where like back in the day if you died you know you you or you'd go back to the save file that you manually made but nowadays yeah. you could just literally save state and just carry on from that screen or whatever um but yeah look, look, so that's where my mind is and if that's like if it, you know if he had any kind of passion for retro gaming then that's the sort of thing that could be cool because like i i would be more than happy to see someone that I liked playing like a Sierra or a, a LucasArts game or something. And and then that's the <laughs> chillest of chill streams as well. Yeah. You know, well, but, especially the Sierra ones where they're, they're shouting out like the text parser stuff, like try this, yeah. try, you know, like that kind of stuff. But no, they fuck no. This is the chat would ruin it. Uh -huh. Chat yeah, would ruin it. You know that click the, you know, give the, give the tube to the pilot. You know, how those games work. Yeah, it would be over two fucking seconds. The part, if you want to see a very, I've said this many times, but if you want to see an interesting stream, watch him play, um, the fucking what's it called, Pi Monkey Island. He did play that way back in the day. And there's no right. chat, and it's interesting because he does, he has to think about stuff. He, he it's interesting because he's he's having fun still with gaming at that point. He's not complaining 100, percent but now he just be complaining. How am I supposed to know that? I got to put the Put the dog in the blender. I wouldn't have guessed that. You know those games. You know mm -hmm. you got to do some yeah. stupid shit in those. You know, and it just wouldn't work. But that's yeah. that's why he's not doing it. He needs the he needs the he still needs the hype because he does. You know the big tippers are no tip no matter what. But he does need the residual smaller tips from people that like the AAA games and literally do want to see him play those new AAA games. In my opinion. But yeah, I haven't studied the uh, the tips tracker in a while to know if that's kind of the case. I'm assuming it is. But it's hard to say as well because he's not playing anything other than those for the most part. So it's hard to compare, I guess. Yeah. There's occasions where he does get, like drift into retro stuff. And he seems to want to. He does seem to want to do it, genuinely, I think. I feel like he yeah. wants to play retro stuff. But it's tough to tell, like... but he's disappointed, yeah. He's sometimes disappointed when those those 
like he was disappointed Crunch Trigger doesn't get money twice now yeah. during the first summer of retro. And then this new time, he's always pissed when they don't get views because yeah. it's like, I want to be able to do this. He says he'll tell you he can, but then when he actually does that thing where he plays whatever games he wants to and people, and then they get low support, he'll say, what happened? I wish I, what happened to support guys. But then he'll mm -hmm. say, I can play whatever game I want to. I'm playing yeah. it now. <laughs> but. The trouble is with like CL says, how did FF seven do like, the trouble is with a game like that is that like I feel like that's just, that's like a forever game. You know, that's always like an evergreen game. Plus, it's got the remake keeping it in the public, you know, consciousness. Mm -hmm. um, so it's it's kind of different. Like it's like everyone knows FF Seven, you know. So it's it's slightly different. It's it'd be like playing like a GTA, like a Vice City, or a, you uh -huh. know, that kind of thing. Or it's just, it's constantly there. You know, yep. uh, if you played, I don't know. Zach McCracken and the Alien Mindbenders is one of my favorite games. You know, no one's fucking heard of that in like 30 years. So like, you know, no one's <laughs> tipping for that, I'm assuming. No, but no, there are fun. people out there that could make that legitimately amazing. Like you, you'd be hooked, you know, and he, he's just not one of them. No. And his fans, his fans, the ones that, I mean, his real fans don't want that either, I think. But, you know. All right, one mm. last message. We got one last one. Who's, uh, who's the most recent one? Give it to Wesker. Come on. Yeah, okay. Wesker, you're the last one, brother. There it is. So, me again. And I just, this just popped in my head listening to the whole tech issues thing and throughout the whole tech stream. Uh, and this is maybe something that all detractors go through. But when with every fill event, it feels like, does anyone go through like the five stages of grief? Because that that's like every fill event for me. It's like I feel like I'm going through the five stages of grief. And it's not for the loss of a loved one, but uh, it's it's the loss of my brain cells. <laughs> Each individual brain cell. Uh, big up, fellas. Please get well soon. Uh, we, the Detractor Nation, would love to see you back on the show, man. Oh, and of course, I got to leave you with my obligatory... <laughs> God. <coughs> oh Too God. Good. Wesker. What was the question? Was it just do like you, an observation? Do, do, I'm not sure exactly. We go through the five stages of grief. Yeah, five, like, that's it. That's it. That's it. But yes. Like with regards to what exactly? I'm not really sure. But. Not exactly sure. But Wesker, you're a legend nonetheless. That's what I can promise mm, you. All yes. right. You will be remembered it's, in history for that yeah. snort. Thank you so much the, for that. The, the snorts make it worth it. Yeah. That's it. We will leave you, and we'll see you on Sunday. Sam, are you there on Sunday? Yes or no? Answer now. Are you coming mm, on the show Sunday? It's a good question, actually. I, I what? Thought yes for definite. I think I am. But, I think I am. Oh God! If you say no, show canceled. Just get it straight. So Sam is your Sam is it's on you now. But anyways, we'll see you Sunday, everybody. Uh, WPIG, we'll see you on Saturday for Density Scrolls again. We got some hype in. We got some hype for a certain member of the FGC, known as um, what's his name, Afro Legends and DSP. Afro Legends and DSP hype on Saturday night. Afro Legends versus DSP. We're gonna go through a lot of stuff on Saturday. You're all legends, and we'll see you Sunday. Uh, we'll tell you about the guest on Sunday. We should get somebody, Sam, but we'll mm. figure it out. Yes, You're all legends. You Thanks everybody. Sam, send us home. Okay, bye everyone. Imagine if they sold a burger with a piece of broken glass in it. Oh, the, the glass burger. Ooh, eat at your own risk. It's a blood-filled adventure. Bye. <laughs> blood-filled adventure. This one goes out to the one and only, the big cat, the fat cat. Big ups. I first saw you in Burger King You took two seats Cause that ass is way too big Had a boyfriend I realized But you told him lies With your raccoon eyes The DoorDash is here Wipe away your tears Got you extra fries And they taste just right 
Have no fear. There is no trolls here. Kevin made you cry with those raccoon eyes. Raccoon eyes. Raccoon eyes. Kevin made you cry with those raccoon eyes. I actually don't think clicking like on a live stream helps at all. So it really doesn't matter if this this stream gets 100 likes or two. I don't think it affects it. told you guys about my past i used to drink way too much i would be drinking constantly all the time because i was so stressed out i was I, honestly when i started with this whole thing i was depressed many years ago you know a decade ago i didn't like my life or anything and basically liquor was the way to kind of get through that you know it was oh i hate my life I hate, I hate who i am so let me just drink it all the way and just keep pumping out fucking youtube videos i don't have to do that shit anymore you know like i'm happy with who i am The Book of Changes, I Ching. <laughs> Come on. It's a book, obviously it's supposed to be Asian. The name of the author was I Ching. I Ching Chang Chong. I Chingy Chang 